and a splashed X100 JBTV flower. Listen, listen, Chad. Okay, Jane is super washed, yeah. And all right. Ah. And all right. LPOV. LPOV, what can I say? On that note, though, I was right. After you go to the hospital twice, you get fucked, bro. Fuck. But she went down with a one punch, man. That was funny as fuck, though. She was a shooter. Oh my god, that was. I'm I'm gonna be very honest. I felt very awkward after that. Felt very awkward about that. And no, it wasn't like anything that like, um, I've even like the Bella's guys or anything like nothing against them. Whatever, fair game. Um, but yeah, it was just like, it sounded awkward. It was, but I think that like. It was awkward from our end, I'd say. Um, just because there was a whole, like, everybody had guns pointed, and then... Yeah, then, like, it, I don't know, man. It was, it was awkward. I just, yeah, I don't even want to talk about it. I need to, I need to, maybe I'll open my, no, I'm going to turn on my fan. Give me a second. It's kind of warm. But yeah, how is everybody? I, so there's a reason why I didn't stream earlier, Chad, okay? I got my visa, I got TwitchCon tickets, I got flights, I got my air, I got everything sorted for TwitchCon. Everything. I got everything. Everything is done. I got everything done. Actually crazy, Chad. I'm so responsible. Good early stream. Yeah, well, get over it, bitch. Get over it. Yeah, just, just get over it. My, I literally, she's been quiet the whole time. She has been quiet the whole time. She gets all the stream. I think it is. Yeah, I think it is. Okay, she's playing with toys now. Hey, Jason. Here to watch you need to quit. Ugh. Now, I'll probably just ask for the motion. Just be a normal officer and don't care about anything else anymore. I have somewhere where I'm appreciated. It's okay. Listen, whenever the marshals become troopers, then, you know? Oh, 
Hello. Hello. Is that her? I don't even know how she looks. These pain killers that I have here, I think that's from Peanut. I forgot to put it on evidence. It's a mess. Yeah, I can... yeah under he, they literally said you can wear whatever one you want. Hey guys. They said as long as it's. Hi, Anita. Balls. I don't recognize them. What's going on, bro? By the way. Ventra, aren't you, aren't you busy today? Yeah, I gotta share it because that's gone. We don't have a, we don't have an LS, we don't have a B system tank or t shirt. But we got one though. I mean, we got, we have a short sleeve, so a uniform shirt. Yeah, I mean, for the TRT thing. Oh, gotcha. 10 hey, Mr. Spindle. Hello, how you doing? Good, good. How are you? There's literally no announcements. There's nothing that to tell people of the new yeah. chief of police. I also the other day asked for High Command to make a statement about like Great. Cohen and Riker, or Cohen and Maeve. Nothing. I, 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 you know what, chat? I tried. I tried. Hey, Duncan. I need it. Love to wear them though. So, How you been? You know, when, whenever they they arrive. Oh, I'm all right. Hi right. guys. Hey Jimbo. Hey Jimbo. Where does that nervous? thing that I just ah. got goes? Oh, you got it. What about yeah. getting up there in front of everybody, saying yeah. hello? I know who the new chief is. You know, I already, oh, fuck already me. introduced myself. Hey! Three I'm just saying from a character perspective, this is very kinda poorly kinda announced because we don't know. Nowhere. I have a couple conversations that I need to have. It is her. Command members. And obviously speak with you. But I, uh, I am trying to pace myself. What? Channel one. Channel one. Channel one. Yeah, pace yourself. Disregard. I'm having it for show. You don't want to go too hard in the paint. Yeah, yeah. 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 These guys are about to get good eggs. You're, you got a good uh, <laughs> Sorry, it's still it. Yeah, I can see that. I uh, think right now focus is getting feedback, uh, hearing you know what's what's working, what needs to be improved, uh, getting outside perspectives as well, and then looking at the business. You wanna, you wanna, all right, cool, cool, cool. You wanna try to go to Texas now? Hold on, hold on, do it. Let's at least wow. go. You suck. Hey, I'll, be up, I'll be up, I'll be up, I'll be up. Uh, 100%, 100%. Be hey guys, shift one, woohoo, yeah, hell yeah, shift one, hell yeah, woohoo. Hey, Wade. Hey, Wade. How are you guys doing? Hey, Wade. Doing shift good. Meeting. Hell yeah, hell yeah, woohoo. Doing good, how are you one. doing? Woohoo, we did. Woohoo, woohoo. I'm in me mom's car. Anyone got any pre-meeting bits? Is Jimbo singing today? Alright guys, false Jimbo, alarm. Jimbo, singing today? Uh, no. Oh. Guys, everyone say oh, so he sings. Oh. He sang yesterday. You gotta get him to sing every day. We didn't hurt him. That's mean. We didn't hurt him because you guys had your BCSO meeting. Some would say. Well, I, that's I not very was, nice to I, say. I, I was going to sing. It was a song that I created and I wrote. But I was not allowed to sing it. Hey, there's a white Hi. car. Hey, Viv. License plate. Hey, I don't know if he told you. Y four N five parked please. outside. It looks like it's illegally That's parked. It's, it's not it. It's, it's not illegally parked. Yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Hi, Billy. 
think it'll help us earn money. But All right, there was like this little uh, these, do these canines have been trained, Viv. <laughs> it was kind of like dead for a second. Uh, have you been told about the new chief? No. Yeah, so uh, there's been a new chief appointed. Uh, they're called Daisy Moss or something. Wait. Yeah. So, um, so I, I had a meeting with Barrick like two days ago as well, where he told me he was uh, promoting me to captain, and obviously that's now not going to happen either. We've got someone that we don't know as chief. I don't know what to think at the moment. What? Uh, apparently she wants to meet with me. I've told my PAs that I'm busy because I'm currently FTON. I'm supposed yeah. to be having a conversation with Nino at some point. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what I'm, do I'm doing or anything, honestly. I I got congratulated by an entire cabinet of people for getting a position then told it wasn't set in stone. And that I was asked what day I was free for uh, the ceremony. And obviously, I guess I had a meeting after that that didn't go so great after talking to pr pretty much everyone I could talk to about an assistant chief. Yeah. I made a suggestion and it blew up massively. He then spewed all this shit about why he didn't like her. He'd given me like basics of why he didn't like her, uh, but he'd never really gone fully into full amounts of detail, you know? And um, I, ca I, I came in, I went into that meeting like, hey, I want to see if I could persuade you or like, you know, convince you on, on Ruby. And uh, I guess that is the reason because I haven't heard anything else. There was no follow-up after that, no nothing. Jesus. And now we have um, a new chief of police. And then who's the ass chief? I don't know. But I don't, I don't... How are you feeling, though? Listen, politics aside and whatever, this is an awful spot on your face. How are you feeling? Yeah, I feel like I've been completely shit on, I'm not going to lie. Holy shit. I should have, uh, to be honest, like Anita, I should have known because this is not the, I'm not the first person this shit has happened to and I'm not going to be the last, so. I should have fucking known, huh? Like how many people before me have had this shit happen? I, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to be honest, I've got no fucking motivation for anything. And now that we've got a new mayor and a new chief, I kind of feel like, you know how it happened with Max, where everyone went running? Yeah. And spread a load of shit about me. Uh, I kind of feel like that's just, I mean, the floodgates are open again, right? I I have always had and always will do. I've, it's not something that I've really minded. The fact that people go along with it and believe absolutely everything without actually having a conversation is what bugs me, but hey. I've always had and always will have a target on my back, so. Because I'm the only person that is like willing to like go to battle for it and fucking die on the hill of, I guess. Uh, I was told uh, by Nino very early on that he was not looking for a dick sucker or a yes man. And the one time like I actually just was like, you know, straight up stood in front of him and was like, I don't think there's anything else that we can do. I guess Holy that lost out. Yeah. Yeah. He wants to talk to me. I don't really want to talk to him, to be honest. I want to know his reason. And that's it. Like, I don't. He's DBD. I don't want to know. I don't want to know anything about the new chief. I'm not interested in the new chief. The new chief is here to do a job. Uh, they can get on with their job. I'll just get on with mine. It is what it is. Uh, but at the moment, I just don't have. I don't know what I'm going to do. This is holy. Shit, this is a lot of information. How did this happen over an I This wow. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, I did let him know that I wouldn't be here yesterday. It was probably why it happened yesterday. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. I mean, in one. Uh, one I honestly, by, like, he is. He's, yeah. This is all gonna him. He's gonna be a max. He's gonna be a max. Yeah. And uh, we all know that Max didn't like me because I didn't just give in to him. And uh, it's likely going to be the same way with that, you know, so because I don't give in to someone easily, I'm the devil. I'm not I'm not good for anything. 
Yeah. I warned him that I was stubborn, but hey. Uh, somehow we go from, you know, people giving my name over, over and over again, which is what he told me, by the way, to uh, some random. Who no one knows, by the way. Yeah. I, I, I think Liam may be up for uh, assistant chief, just as he was trying to push Liam with me. And I think we're going to have two shift two high commands. Because <laughs> Dad saved it last time. I... Yeah. You know what, Viv? I think it's time to just chill, patrol, fuck off the politics, and just... Yeah. 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 I... I it comes down to a point that... There's just so much work that you can put in before you people actually see how valuable you are. And if people don't appreciate that, then it's on them. It's their loss. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. uh... Uh, good luck with everything. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know. I, uh, we I, could all just get squashed down. So well, I'm, yeah, I'm fully probably. expecting it because there's probably hordes of people going to complain. Yeah, and honest, um, so. they're probably gonna hear everything. They're gonna hear all of the they're general issues and because, believe it. And you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, let's go to this. Me I'm now. I'm curious about this meeting. What? I'm. Please don't expect me to get up there and say no. Anything that's that's fine. I'm don't don't worry. Don't worry. Don't 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 worry about it at all. I like that. Right next to the exit door in the uh in the garage. That is motor parking, right? And if you park in the middle, you can't get a bike out. So please, uh, even if you got a 95, do not park there. Otherwise, no one can pull a fucking bike out. Thank you very much. I'm going to blow um, up your car if you park there. Just don't you park there. Just, don't, just uh, that's motor parking. Just don't park after the meeting. We go back to Vic. Uh, yeah, as long as it's five minutes. Uh, I'm going to blow up your car. You're saying metaphorically, you're going to. I also need to give somebody else a call. So. No, I'm. I can. I can compress it. Don't worry. Hey, CPT. Taught me everything. Okay. All right. There's not going to be any explosions, guys. There's not going to be any bombs. Okay. Sometimes you just gotta ask, guys. Sometimes you just gotta ask and ask for people to move. You know what we could do? We could reach out to high command and see if there's like a sign that could be installed to advise that it's motor only or something like that. Okay? Maybe we can try that before thinking and talking about bombs. Okay? Thank you. See you later. You thought about it. I'm sorry. Anyway, move it on. Move it on. Anyone else got any any announcements? I have a question. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. I'm gonna rebound it off you because Jimbo had me thinking with this title. My questions for uh for Angel. Angel, what is Hi. your what is your full title? Is it Supreme Justice Overlord Head Marshal Brittany Angel or is there more? Uh, well, I have two titles. Director. I have two titles. It's just Justice Angel or Director Angel. Okay, which one? Is there one that is Say both? Okay. Uh, yeah, one? Justice is the the more in like the higher one, so Justice Angel is like my main title. Okay, that's if we're being the most respectful, we'll call you Justice Angel. Uh, yeah, if you're trying to be disrespectful, then don't, please. I would appreciate that. Can I call didn't. you Brittany? No, that's not a that's not appropriate. I mean, in personal context, yeah, yeah, and like yeah, like, yeah. like in like personal conversations, yeah, that's fine. But like oh, in, a, in a formal way, no. But personally, yeah, shit, that's fine. So if we're speaking to you as a marshal, record with is Britney bitch. Uh, d yeah, definitely don't do that. That would not be appropriate. Britney bitch. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. What about Angle? If I called you, no, no. Angle, sorry, that's no, an old right. nickname. I haven't been called that in a long time. Well, ang Angle, if I said if I said a direct Angle, well, you'd be like my old protege Fury if you called me Angle. Uh, uh, my old uh, SRU nickname. Can I call you Brit Angle? I. Uh, well, I'm honestly, if we're friends, I don't really care what you call me as long as it's not in the courtroom. Friends? So, nah, you ain't friends. yeah, we're friends. You guys, oh, I guess we're friends. Yeah. We're war buddies, Jim, but why wouldn't we be friends? Right, guys, we saved the wait, state wait, together. Bad so. news, guys. A lot of people are moving down the list. Director, are we friends? I mean, we're, you know, acquainted. Nice. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh.
girls. Yeah, yeah, you are up there. there. Damn. <laughs> uh, let's continue with the meeting. Uh, go ahead, Marcus. Leave Britney alone. I command any announcements. I command. We got Assistant Chief Ruby York in the back. You got any announcements? Oh. Chief. Oh, oh, oh my God. 47. Forty-seven. Why did you do that? Sorry. Why did you? Let, why did you? Take that. Why did you walk into her fist? I'll go ahead and defer to the new chief. Uh, I'm, I believe she probably has the best announcement. Oh my okay. God. Oh my god, that's not my new boss! Oh, wait, what? Alright, uh, hello everyone. Uh, I've met some of you already, but for those who don't know me, I am the new chief of police, Daisy Moss. I was appointed by Nino, uh, last night. Uh, Congrats. over... Woo! Thank you. Congrats. Congratulations! Appreciate Congratulations. that. Congratulations! Uh, I'm sure many of you have questions, and I'd be happy to speak to you one-on-one. -on -one. Over the next few weeks, I intend to speak to as many people within the LSPD as I can. I'd like to get your feedback. I'd uh, like to hear Bullshit. what you have to say about the department, about your experience within it. And uh, I just look forward to, to getting to know everyone. Uh, yes, you have a question? Uh, it, it's normally customary when new, new people in the meetings are introduced themselves, they say a fun fact about themselves. Amen, um, amen. We gotta keep if, you, if you have a fun fact yeah, yeah. to share. A fun, fun fact. Um, uh, for, for before... Warning, uh, Jack Boss takes pictures, so just just so you don't get confused. <laughs> yeah, no, creeped no, out. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. What fruit is that? It's a papaya. Okay, good, good to know. Um, well, uh, before I started working here, I was a ranger up in Oregon, and in the summertime... I, uh, I got to see uh, cute little pikas, you know, they would come through the state park. So that is uh, a Is that a four-legged four animal or what kind of, what kind of, what kind of it's, animal? It's kind of like a, a mix between a chinchilla and a bunny rabbit. Pikachu. What the fuck is a chinchilla? It's like a, it's like a, uh, look, look it up. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a, rat, it's like a rat rabbit. Oh, okay, 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 I see, I see, I see, I see. Big chinchillas? Hmm. That's By cool. the way, she averages 80 at monkey type. So, Alright. Fun fact. Well, just uh, feel free to reach out if you'd like to speak with me after the meeting. Hell yeah, appreciate you, Chief. Chief. My Chief. god, Denzel! Uh, command, any command? Viv? You got anything? Uh, uh, no, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Nothing new. Thank you. Wait. No, no, no. Seniors, seniors, any seniors? Think you got anything? Maxwell in here? Nah. Yeah, I heard that. I was on radio. Oh. Did she already do her uh, promotion uh, speech, all that shit? Did I miss that? Huh? Did you know, she like, did. Pre you did peach? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry. I missed she that. did. Okay. She did do a very nice speech. Yeah, you guys hear? Wade's going to buy me a car. Uh, no. Nope. Oh, wow. No, no, no. That's really no, nice no, of no, you, no, Wade. No, no. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. No, I'd like to make a statement about guys. it. I have something Ooh. after, Marcus. Statement about that. Duncan promised to buy me a PD bike, and then he went back on his promise. He said he's not buying it. It's a way for High Command to reimburse my... Okay. Wait, hold on. He also promised to split the Peach's car with me, and he said he's not doing that either. I don't think I'm getting yeah. that 300k from Peach doesn't get her. If Peach doesn't get her car, blame Duncan. Don't mind me. Um, what? Justice Angel, you got anything? Yeah, I got something really quick. All right. Well, my hands up, but it doesn't matter. Ooh, oh, Angel. Wait, wait. Sorry, 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 Justin. Uh, oh, Dimbo's so got a question. Right. You're just kicking so me off the phone. I'm no, already no, up no, here. No, no, no. So, uh, fuck me, all right. Fuck, fuck me. I, I already came up here. And... Go ahead, Angel. Go ahead. You, I mean, you already look ahead, bad. You, you, you already Jack, look stop bad. Stop so... into me. Like, it's too late. <laughs> Jack, go sit down. <laughs> okay. Hey, guys. Um. So, just a quick reminder. Um. Hey. So, for those of you who weren't here yesterday, we announced a bunch of new charges surrounding the use of drones. Um, there's a bunch of, there's a new hag charge, uh, and there's a bunch of new possession charges, so make sure you familiarize yourself with them. We are adding new charges and amending all the ones by the day. We're also going to be amending the drug trafficking process and, uh, going over some other stuff. So if, if you've done an investigation in the moonshine, and you have some information that you'd like to share with us in the DOJ, that you think could help, be helpful to us coloring this process out, please, uh, grab me after the meeting. I'd love to hear it. Um, but the most important thing that I want to let you guys know 
is that uh, as of yesterday, uh, dark tint is illegal for everyone, including government officials and their vehicles. So if you have a tint that you can't see through, you got to go take that off. Um, it's illegal now, so you can't have it. Otherwise, you're going to get citations. So Thank God. Amen. So Amen. that's pretty much the only changes. So, you know, I'm also looking to add some new laws and reduce some processes. So, again, my number is in the yellow pages. You ever want to give me a call? I appreciate it. I always like to talk to people about law stuff. That's why I am a justice, because I like law. So, thanks, guys. So that's pretty much it. We did uh, get a couple new uh, marshals, by the way. If you're not familiar with them and you don't... Uh, like, recognize them, you're more than welcome to... Jimbo, is that you? What the... If you rec don't recognize the marshal and you want to check them for identification, make sure that you request a badge, and then you can check their MDT profile. Those two things together will determine if they're a marshal or not, if you're ever confused, if you haven't met them. So, don't let people false flag. Um, but that's everything for me. Thank you, guys. I got, I got a question. I, I got a question. Oh. oh, I actually, one more thing I forgot to mention. We also have created, and then I'll do questions. <laughs> we've also created a new charge, robbery of a high security institution. Um, I know it's not new, but we've essentially split it into two. So there's low security and high security institution. It specifically outlines which are which. So just remember that if you arrest someone for a 24 7 or like a cash exchange, that'll be a Excellent low security institution, security. something like the Maze Bank or something even higher than that would be a high security. Nice. Um, questions. All right. I'll just go. I'll just go. Um, okay. um, so are we, is there going to be like, are we looking for any legislation that's like going to basically allow people to apply for a tent or is just, just going to, uh, legal? We'll, what we'll probably do is, uh, um, we'll, we'll probably allow it like for specific use cases. So like, say for example, so a unit like TRT needs dark tint for whatever reason. Yes. They could make their case to a justice, and then we could essentially allow them mm -hmm. to have it if they have valid enough reasoning for it. Uh, and justice, then, just can I speak to you after this meeting, please? Sure, we could talk after the meeting. Is there um, a grace period? For the, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, yeah. You guys have like 24 hours to figure it out. So, all right, cool. So I'd go get your your tents changed while you still can. Um, technically, it's illegal, but I'm not gonna have my marshals giving out citations for it until you guys um have that that chance to change it. So. Um, someone else had a question in the back? Uh, it pretty much answered my question, because I was going to ask about, you know, police operations protecting their identity and, like, yeah. undercover work and stuff like that. Yeah, if, uh, essential. yes, if, if, you know, if a unit wanted to do undercover stuff, again, we can create exceptions for that, but they need to be granted. They're not just going to be given to everyone in the PD as a whole. Is that default, on a so. unit basis, or would that be on a, like, incident? It would, it would likely be an individual vehicle basis. But units could basically request all of their vehicles, and then we would consider it at that point. So um, it would basically be specific vehicles would be allowed to have them, and we would create a registry for that. Um, I also wanted to let you guys know, I forgot to tell you guys this yesterday. Oh, you have a, another question? Are, are you and the uh, chief of police related? You have very similar hair and bone structure. I I noticed that, but no, actually, there's no relation at all between us. You guys look really similar, like especially from a distance. Oh, yeah, we kind of we kind of do, don't we? Oh, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, guys, listen, yeah. listen, listen, listen. The rumors that I have cloned myself to install myself as <laughs> chief of police are just that rumors. Okay. I didn't, I didn't heard those rumors. They, they, are they are just they are just rumors. Okay. Can we check DNA? Check with. I uh, stay. You're not touching my DNA, you Jack, freaking why weirdo. Get away from me. Get away from me, Jack. I have a question. What's wrong with you? Yeah. The fact know. that Jack even asked that makes me question um, a lot of things. We saw. I saw a car today that That's us, man. the tint on the windshield was fine, but the uh, the passenger windows were were too dark. Are we going based off? <laughs> I should do it. Uh, we'll take you as yeah, chief. Yeah. So basically, like. It. It. They can't have any tint on any windows. I'll, I'll probably like window. specifically define the, 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 the one. Actually, I'll do this once she's that, out yes, of if, the... If only their back the window thing. is unsee throughable or too tinted, that still counts as illegal tint. So okay. I'll, uh, I'll write that definition in. So. Okay, thank you. Um, so one more thing I forgot to mention yesterday. I probably should have told you guys. Uh, your chiefs of police and sheriffs have access to, and your high command structures really, have access to a new internal bank account that is assigned for your department specifically. Um, each department generates money for that account um, by the fines that they create by doing their job. However, the location that you process your suspects and matter. So if you are down here in uh, Los Santos County and you process someone in Mission Row, the money will go to LSPD. And if you go out to Blaine County, it's the mm. Blaine County Sheriff's Office, the money goes to the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Mm. 
Mm. So just remember that whenever you're processing people and how your budgetary what uh, is my bills dog yes, doing? Uh, do you think that there'll Hiya. be like a charitable organization set up for Blaine because of their? I mean, that's bad. Use your words carefully. I'm not. Use your fucking words carefully, Carmen. I don't know what you're asking here, Carmen. There's only so much money you can get from citing people for roadkill violations and fishing. Okay, Carmen didn't realize what you said. Carmen, that's kind of rude. Yeah, it's it's okay. Yeah, in the back, you had a question. Hi, Officer Vic Hanna. Okay, Officer Vic. So when we apprehend someone's city, do we 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 are we supposed to process them in the city, or is it? If they apprehend somebody in the city who committed crimes in the city, are they taking them to Blaine County to process them? How does the jury? I, uh, I ultimately, there's no law stating where you have to process people. Um, any like potential restrictions would come from your high command and how they want to figure that out. So, um, just remember this: the very simple adage, "Crime is committed where the crime is committed is how they'll be charged." Doesn't matter where they end up at the end of it. Um, where they committed the crime uh, is what matters. I'm not gonna lie, we did a pretty good job this morning. Like, uh, we uh, BCSO took, uh, I think, two ninety fives, and we kept one, and kind of, you know, making sure they they eat also. Does that make yeah, sense? I mean, that's that's totally fine. I, at the end of the day, there's no law saying you have to to do it in a specific area. BCSO has the right to be here, and they have the right to process people wherever. So, well, not right, but like, there's nothing to say they can't. So, that's up to your high command, basically. Right now. Uh, did you have a question, uh, Ruby? Uh, no, I. No, it doesn't matter. Oh, okay. All right. Well, um, do you guys have any more questions for me? Nope. Okay. Uh, just one more thing I'd like to remind you guys. Um, your individual mayors may set your pay, but depending on where you are in the state is what your pay levels are. So if you're down here, you're getting paid by LS, uh, by Los Angeles County standards. And if you go up north, oh, you get paid by uh, Blaine County standards. So just keep that in mind. Um, if you ever confused. Oh, yeah, hold on. How much I getting paid? <laughs> I, I don't know. Ask, ask your mayor. City boys up good. City boys up good. And uh, finally, no, finally, finally, your, bucks, your paychecks will be collected from the dependent, the different banks of where you were made that money. So oh. May's Bank will be for any money made in the Los Angeles County and Polito Bank will be for anything made up north. Wait, so, so. so I probably got a paycheck in Polito away from me? Yeah, yeah. probably. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's so just so remember hard. that Perfect. if people are very curious or anything, just, uh, yeah. But that's pretty much everything from me, guys. If you have any questions, uh, catch me after the meeting. It's okay. Thank you, Justice Angel. Thank you, Justice Thank Director you. Angel. Yeah, you're very welcome. Thank you. Uh, oh, hi, Jimbo Sun had an announcement. Yeah, I got an announcement. Hi, guys. Hey, Jimbo. Hey, Jimbo. Hey, Jimbo. Hi, Jimbo. Um, hey, Jimbo. I think it was yesterday or the day before, hey, uh, Denzel Shiesty gave me the pass. Um, um, I'd like to return that pass yeah. back to him, as I okay. will not be using it. Okay. Right. Yeah. What pass? Right. Right. Well, well, what pass? Returning the pass is kind of important. Thank you. Ventura, yeah, Thank Ventura, you, next. Mo. Ventura, go ahead. Yeah. Go next, Ventura. Okay. It's come to my attention. Hello, it's Vincent. Uh, it's come to my attention that I was not relieved as my duty uh, as uh, assistant to the chief of police. So if you need to talk to a uh, new chief mom, I want uh, the motion dome. Me now, let me know uh, and I'll get it coordinated uh, and we'll get that figured out. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Fair. <laughs> you would make a great. <laughs> hey, two, two, three. Fair on to the, the motion. What are you I'm sure on the ladder what? though. What the fuck just happened? Hey, morning everyone. My name is Denzel Shikes. I'm happy to be here. Um, So we got some info that uh, uh, sanitation robber, uh, sanitation workers will be, uh, they're probably gonna get robbed a lot today. Um, there's some type of thing going on um, with the mayor's office. I'm not sure if Tilly wants to speak on that, but uh, we're gonna, you know, keep- not too long ago about it. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, just keep an eye out for sanitation robbers, okay? Uh, I think uh, me and the operators are gonna keep an eye out on them completely all day today. Uh, and last, last but not least, yeah, the situation there, happened right? with Hydra before the, before the storm. I don't know. Uh, good shit. Good shit to everyone. I just want to say thank you so much for all hands on deck. Uh, that's it for me. That's it. Bye. Thanks, Shiesty. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, a Hydra situation in shift one? Oh, yeah. We yeah. fucking Oh, yeah. That. That's crazy, guys. That's crazy. Huh? Minolta, you got anything? Who would have thought? Um, sure, I can make something up. Sure. I don't know, like, like, you know, like, yeah, move on, shit, you got me. in my way.
Hey guys, what's going on, everybody? I don't even know. This is really nice of Angel. Mary Joseph McNulty. What's going on, everybody? How's how's your Saturday? Hi, I don't Sorry. I don't work on Saturdays. Uh, fuck that. I'm here to do paperwork. The old paper bitch. Um, and then I'm going to take a uh, I think a 15 pack of uh, PBRs, and I'm gonna Maybe go to the golf car course. I'm gonna get tanked. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. What you driving, McNulty? Really no hard liquor. What am I drive? What do I drive? A Toyota Tacoma 2008 truck. All right. Oh Hell no. Yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. That's right. Hey, McNulty, where are you from? Where am I from? Sounds really? like you're from the Midwest. Drinking PBRs. Driving What's wrong with PBRs? It's cheap and cheerful, like our motor. Anyway, let's keep it professional, guys. Keep it professional, Hey, yo, keep it. Hey, is that a gun? That wasn't. You don't have the balls, Jimbo. Oh. Oh. You let him know, Char. You let him know. Exactly, Jimbo. Take your unprofessional ass and sit down. Excuse me, McNulty. I'd like to just announce. Wait, time out. Time out. Time out. I'm gonna say it, McNulty. I didn't like that comment. Oh, okay. And you know what, Jimbo? What? I apologize. Your mother oh, is a good, good shit, baby. There we go. You're your mother, you're your mother, your mother is expensive and sad. Is that better? What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh, get what? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? That's the opposite of cheap and cheerful. Oh shit, he's gone. Oh. She's still here. Hey, uh, I've been Lieutenant McNulty. Appreciate oh, yeah. you all. No, love you guys. Here. Hold it down, shift one. Love you guys. My LG. Cool. All right. Uh, yeah, it's 40 after, y'all. Let's just wrap this shit up. Uh, unless anyone else has an, anything important. Oh, nope, no goers. All right, perfect. Uh, let's <laughs> say the Pledge of Allegiance. Get the fuck out there. Put some criminals in jail. How about that? Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Mm. Oh, excuse me, Miss Chief. Yo. Yo. Hey, Lucas, leave the pledge. So far, oh, you've Miller. had one excuse request. Lucas, I'm McNulty. Hello. I love Ireland. Hi, Anita. Hey. Hello. Good, how are you? Lucas, can I speak to you in my office? Yeah, you don't have an office, baby, but it's for yeah, wherever dude, you want to talk. Yeah. Hold on. This seems to be a me thing, Anita. It's a you thing, Duncan. Yeah, okay. look, okay. I'm a Hayes GPT, okay? Oh my god. Let me god. spread my Good wings, okay? Good luck, Viv. Okay. <laughs> what do I need today? We got one more repair kit for sure. Eh? Hello, how are you doing? Hello, good of yourself. Good. Hey, fellow cops. Hey, Bean. How you doing? How you been? I've been alright. I've been alright. How you been? I'm good. I really like the vest. They're really cool. It looks good, right? They're really good. It's really good. Well. Yeah. Mm. And we got a couple good vests, Anita. You know? Uh huh. Up north, it's pretty good. I don't you ever, know. Uh, you ever feel like wearing the town again? The silver and gold. I'm going to tell you something, Bean. Um, before. Mm -hmm. Bones and Cassidy won the election. I told Cassidy, no matter who won, wins, um, I'm interested in going to the Blaine County. Mm. Um, that, was, that, that was it. That, that, was, that was a long time ago. And uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm just living right now. But uh, I mean, the fact that no one came to talk to me about that after, after they got announced or anything like that, and it makes me feel like I've never been like an option or anything like that to go there. So, yeah, it might, maybe it's just okay. You're a sergeant and yeah, probably. Running shift. It it could be. It it really could be, and it would hurt shift one. 
Um, yeah. But yeah, I mean, it's okay. No worry. Don't. Yeah. I'm. I'm here. I'm living. I need to. God damn it. Right. Let us know. Uh huh. Yeah. Sure. Hey, honey. Hello. What the fuck Hi. How you doing? Come on. I was just. I was gonna. Oh, you know what? Okay. You know. Oh yeah. No. No. I'm sorry. Um, okay. No. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay. Ah, I didn't know. <laughs> I just need to throw the trash away. Fine. I'm sorry. You're fine. Um, do you want a smoothie that is about to go bad? And I'll trade you for food. I'll trade you for food. What do I have? I don't have any food. What the heck, honey? I only have drinks. I have two drinks on me right now. And that's it. Unless it's okay. I'll totally. What? Can you? Adam. Honey. Yeah. Honey, why do yeah. you have worms? Because I'm carrying them around in like a jar full of dirt and I'm like, eating them. <sighs> you know it's the more you... worms, honey. You know, you know the more you turn around, the more I'm just gonna look at your ass. Okay, that's. Fine, I do the same to you, but still, okay? <laughs> it still doesn't invalidate the fact that you're carrying around worms. Listen, what's wrong right with a jar of like dirt and a few worms? They don't come with me home, they just stay in my locker. No, uh -huh, okay. I wonder, I wonder if like I should go talk go to, to the my locker chief. Anyway. I'm what? so confused about everything. It's so weird. I I don't even know. Why are you so confused about Barrick? I don't think he's even on duty. Honey, the new chief's name is Daisy Moss. She was picked by Lino last night. Um, I'm sorry, who? And I don't, I, I don't who? know. I don't know. I don't know who they are. Um, But it's done. It's Picked, and I don't know if I should go talk to them or not. I'm very confused, but at the same time, I'm I'm commend for shift one, so I feel like I should. To them. It's just, uh, I, yeah, probably. I mean, it would probably be a good idea. Are you doing? You know what? I'm contacting her assistant. I'm okay. Hey, she already God. has an assistant. Yep. I got Copeland yesterday as a PTO, so that's good. Everything Hell is yeah. done. Um. And yeah, I mean, kind of in. Nothing too super crazy. Um. Just trying to see, cause I want to do like, uh, uh, I want to do something different for the hiring for Shift One. Uh, let's see when yeah, I'm gonna that's organize fine. that. Were you on the radio yesterday, by the way, at night, like uh, when I was on shift? Uh, depends on when. Um, uh, I say, uh, I don't know, it was like when Conan was saying a bunch of shit towards Jaden. Oh, yeah, 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 I was on radio for that. Um, yeah, it started because me and Mark kind were getting food. Oh my god, okay, yeah, I, I. Took care of it, but then you went to the marshals, so I don't know. Oh, so you really took care of it? Yeah. <laughs> Not like that. I didn't do shit. Damn, like... you just straight up fired. No, I dabbed him. Oh that was God. it. No, I only I dabbed him. That was it. <laughs> okay, so daffing means equals fire. No. <laughs> no, it was not the case. Maybe well, I mean, steal your wife. You steal my wife. That's what? fine. It's okay. Huh? Yeah. I need okay. some more. Well, know, I mean, at least you had the balls to actually dab someone. Out. I've, yeah, I mean, 
honey, you know me. There's I've always not had a lot of people. Can I say? Yeah, it's fair, but there's not a lot of people. Oh yeah, no, there was other people within the same yeah. rank and or abo above that didn't do shit about it. But that's okay. I need to take this call and then I need to call Sherry. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I think I'm Sherry is trying to, to poach me. Oh god, can you tell to poach me too? Okay. Or sure. Hello. Hey Nina, I'm done with my talk. Viv, uh, Viv, Viv blew up as soon as Peach opened her mouth. What do you mean blew up? She blew up. Anyway, I was trying to say something motivational because she seemed pretty sad. Um. I mean, I think I, I, think, it, I think I did a good job. Okay, I used that's my words. Good. I need to call Sherry. Give me a second. Hey, you were you were messing with me yesterday, right? You were just messing <laughs> with me, little little ha ha. You need to call Sherry. You you were just messing with me yesterday, right? Yeah, please don't mess with me like that. Yeah, welcome aboard. Hey, Nadia, where's gone? Uh, Anita? Sorry, just, um... Who is, uh... You were just messing with me yesterday, right? A little, little, little grief? Right. Yeah. Sure. Um... Just a little ha, -ha moment? Right. Uh -huh. Why do you need to call Sherry? Uh, just have to. Oh, there we go. Hey there, Sherry. How you doing? Hey, Anita. How's it going? Oh, it's uh, it's uh, it's a day. It's a day that ends yeah. with a Y. And then a day That's that ends with a Y. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I suppose. Well, wah! Jesus are you Christ! Okay? Sherry, are you dying? No, I'm not. Amber was fucking crying on the sidewalk, that bitch. Anyway. Huh. Uh, yeah, I assume that you have met your new chief of police. <laughs> I did. Uh, yes. Easy Moss, huh? Yeah, I got to know about it in the morning. Shift 3 was... Oh, I, okay. Oh, my quiet. head. Bye. <laughs> okay, my can crash. I played it out thinking things, but just to throw it away. Played it out. So anyway, chat. Here's the thing. No matter what, no matter what I say, no matter what I do. No matter how much dooming and complaining can be done, the decision is done. There's literally nothing that we can do. And in reality, like... Cade is gonna do the best that she can. Now, what's gonna come out of it? I don't have no idea. No clue. Talk and try to get to know this character. I like patrol too much. Put it on. I don't think anyone is like upset that it's Kane with a new character or anything like that. It's just really the perspective that like from a PD perspective and from uh like even like an outsider's perspective, like the build up to that whole th decision was very null.
Kangu, thank you so much for the gift itself for 53 for the gift itself for the tier one soy for 53 months you potato you're the best right now right i miss you though i miss you bo miss you bo hope you're still here sorry it's just a lot of meanings my brain goes poof Uh, Anita, I will let you know when she's ready for you. Sure, sure. Sorry, I just had to. I just really wanted to nap in the hallway for yeah. a minute. She's talking to Tilly right now. You're next in line. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll give you a call when she's ready. Uh, yeah, sure. Where's the? Oh, Duncan's okay. here. I need oh, it. gotta return my call. Yeah, you um. What what's what's the call about? Hey Anita. Hey, sorry. Hey. I just had oh, a headache. It was crazy. Yeah. How are you doing today, Anita? I'm doing so. You know, I need some fresh air, Duncan. Give me a second. I need you to like walk <laughs> away from every fucking idiot that you have around you, even your chief of police that happens to have a cadet uniform on. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, Cherry. Uh -huh. Um, it's, um, it was a very surprising news. And, uh -huh. um, yeah. Alright. Do you want to jump to ship? I'm going to be plain and simple. Do you want to jump to ship right now? I want to patrol, Sherry, though. That's the thing. Fuck your patrol, you guys, like, okay? Make... Okay, okay, yeah, well, listen. Can you Honestly. make, like, a trooper's division or something like that? Here's the thing. Patrol might come in future. That's the thing. Okay. Why I say might? Because... Right now, the department is quite small, okay? It's going to have its own little specialization where you would be out there, you know, doing some sort of, like, work because you're supposed to investigate big organizations and crime scenes and things like that where you would be like, hey, LSPD, you're quite shit at your job. I'm taking over. You will quite literally do that. I'm not even kidding. So why the fuck not just do something which makes you actually happy? How many times have you patrolled? Let's be honest. Uh, I've been coming around in later in the day to be mm -hmm. able to patrol. And so do you I patrol? actually patrolled twice in the last two days, yes. Okay, how much do you patrol? I, anyway, I, uh, you know what, I just, um, I patrol, I don't patrol that bunch, but I do a couple of hours of patrol, yes. And I do want to do more. That's kind of like my okay. focus. Uh, I do, okay. I do need to meet with the chief now. They're ready to talk to Oh, them. yeah? Yeah, okay, you well, know what? I'll call, call you after my call. I'll call you after my call. Yeah, get disappointed sure. and then call me, okay? Okay, yeah, sure. Don't believe her. All right, lies. bye. Don't believe her lies, Anita. <laughs> oh, Lincoln. Hey, Anita, assistant hey chief, please. Yeah. She's ready oh. for you. Okay, we're we're. Hey, chief, where are we meeting? Uh, where would you like to meet? Uh, I'm fine with whatever. Um, we need the records room, though. I beg your pardon. The the records room by the reception on the side. Uh, or the meeting room, somewhere where keep people just can eavesdrop everything. I'll be the meeting room. <laughs> do like you at the, at the far wall? Do you want do you want to go to the roof or something or? Uh, the thing with the roof, I mean, unless we're just talking very quietly, people can still hear us from downstairs. Mm. Yeah, there's okay, been yeah, several reports the, of that. The, the meeting room. Yeah. Just go to the far wall, and nobody will hear you. It's fine. Um, I say this because I feel like everybody is just trying to hear all of the tea that is happening and I just don't want people to hear the wrong thing and then just take the wrong uh, conclusions of things and then just run with it. But hi, I'm I'm Sergeant Anita May, Sergeant First Shift 1. Um, Hello, it's, it's great to meet you. It's good to meet you too. Um, I'm not going to lie and I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Um, very surprised. Surprise uh, about the decision for um for chief uh from the mayor um but um at the same time I would like to hear what are you I mean I understand that you're probably this is your first day right um you're trying to get your 
keep settled with everything and everyone um in a way i just want to talk to you to one for you to know who i am um and at the same time to know if there's anything like if you have any plans anything that you're uh trying to implement especially in shift one um uh just to give you some clarification shift one has been um i i would like to explain this um there's been a lot of challenges throughout the past few months with shift one um we went from having one so sort of structure to then having another sort of structure then um just a lot of things changing a lot of people in command roles changing and one thing that we always lacked was uh, a strong foundation um of like I would want to say like experienced officers, people that want to train to then train the next waves and so on. We've always liked a little bit of that compared to other shifts. Um, but it started becoming a little bit better lately uh, within the last month, two months and so on. So um, trying to give a little bit of a rundown on things. Hey, Guided. All right. Um, how long have you been a sergeant for? Uh, four months, maybe five now. Um, it's been, it's been a while, but I was only a senior for five days, so. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And, um... I, I heard what you had to say regarding shift one and i would ask uh as a sergeant as a command member do you feel or have you felt support from high command and your superiors in shift one um okay so um if it when it comes down to viv and so on i uh she is probably one of the bigger advocates for shift one in general She's always been. Um, if something happens, if something is needed, and so on, especially when we never had high command coverage for uh, for shift one, um, she's always been the one to um, to highly be very vocal. And uh, I say this because she's also very vocal about. Um, I mean, uh, she was very vocal to high command whenever we needed something or so on. Um, with high command, um, I, I would say that I've had more conversations with Barrick than Ruby itself, but I also feel like it's a little bit like um, schedules and or timing. Um, and I say that because um, uh, uh, we had like two types of conversations with with. I, uh, Two very significant type of conversations with Beric. It was either um, I am trying, um, giving it the benefit of the doubt to, for things to change, uh, and then not much changed. And then after myself and Viv, I don't know if Nakoda was a sergeant at the time or not, uh, brought up some concerns. Uh, Beric was like, it's your shift, do as you feel fit. Um, but that can only happen till a certain point. Like, there's just so much that we can do, right? But um, even in the way that it was to do bring you feel promotions. You don't have authority as command members to, um, to lead shift one? So uh, I, I would say this more behind hiring and promotions. It wasn't like it wasn't on us, it needed to be. Um, Hiring is better now, though, so I don't think it's much of an issue. Oh my god. Yeah, that's that's McNulty. <laughs> um, I don't think hiring is much of a uh, concern right now. I think things are becoming a little bit better. Um, but then when it comes down to like promotions and so on, uh, we always found ourselves on who we're gonna promote next. Um, and there's two things here. We can either promote people into a role and hope that they do, but good. 
or promote people that we feel like are very deemed to that pro that position, right? Um, and for Shift One, uh, I mean, we, myself and Viv pushed a lot of names like Kaylee and King. Um, even like when we wanted Nakota to be a sergeant, it took like weeks before he even got like to sergeant. Uh, same with the seniors, like we always had to push and so on. And sometimes some clarification and communication a little bit earlier would have been a little bit nicer. But, um... Okay. Um, I, I do think it's important that... Here, here's where I stand. Here's uh, what I... I feel like I'm saying a lot but not others. saying shit. Um, my position as chief of police is to make sure that you have the tools that you need to do your job to the best of your ability. I am, I am here to support you. I am here to help you with whatever you need. Uh, if you need to run ideas through me, uh, if you need guidance, um, but as far as I'm concerned, uh, the people that are in command, uh, whether that's lieutenant or sergeants, they are leading their shifts. They should essentially be able to lead their shifts without me having to step in or needing my okay for something. Uh, if they don't feel that they are able to do that, uh, then we need to make adjustments because this department needs to run whether or not I'm here. And I you shouldn't I have to be here to run. Well, I expect it to run the same regardless of whether I'm on duty or off duty. Um. Yeah. I, I mean, sorry. Here you go. My focus uh, over saying? the next few weeks will be speaking to everyone, um, hearing out what is working, what is not working uh, in the department, in their positions. I want to hear your feedback and your experience. Uh, what makes you come on duty and what makes you eh, not really feel like going on duty that day? Uh, I will be taking this information and, you know, applying it essentially to any decisions that I make moving forward. I, I don't want to rush choices as well. I am hoping to get a very good understanding of the department and what's going on and people, how people are feeling before any decisions are made um, so that it is, uh, you know, an, uh, basically an educated decision. Uh, my focus is that I want to help people basically enjoy their time when they come on duty. Uh, that is the main goal. Uh, I want officers to feel empowered, to feel confident, uh, to feel like they are well trained and know what they are doing uh, to relieve some of that stress of, you know, am I doing the right thing? And, you know, just be excited to come on duty and motivated. Yeah, that's fair. Um, I do think that's what a lot of people do want, especially from command and so on. Um, I've, I've heard that from a lot of people um, in general, because at the end of the day, I mean, we just want our officers to be happy about what's happening and um, about their job and feeling satisfied to come around. Um, um, okay. Um, when it comes down to um, hiring and so on, I had an idea that I brought to Viv and Haley like last week. Um, and I wanted to do, like, an open day for the LSPD, like, bring, like, allow who people is, to check um, on their... Mm -hmm. Who is in charge of p and and Ship 1? Haley Maxwell, one of our senior officers. Okay. Yeah. She's a very 
motivated she's very good she's someone that um is uh she's always taking cadets she's very organized uh she's done now uh two academies that she uh mostly organized on a shift one so yeah um uh so basically the idea is to allow people to come in say hi uh tell us about their interest uh either update their application or check on their applications or put in an application and so on properly advertise this and do this during like uh early shift one which is when we need a lot of coverage because our shift three into one um as like the, the coverage and the um, between shifts the lacks presence overall um would you are you okay with things like that i i don't have a problem you don't have to it. answer right um, now by the way it's more like I, one of those things and ideas i think when it comes down to you know advertising for hiring and having you know uh like job fairs whatever you want to call it uh i think that's a conversation that you have with the pnt lead uh with your lieutenant and if there is you know something that you need from me you know you need me to be there for it um but i think that the people that are put in those positions are more than capable of being able to make those decisions for themselves. Now, if it is a matter of adjusting procedure and the training program as a whole, Aww. that is when I come in. Okay. Um, I do think that we need to adjust our training program. Um, I think we do as well. Uh, I'm going to be very honest with you. Um, my very uh, personal opinion is uh the fact that we have no finals or uh we, we we're basically putting cadets uh, into a ppo status for 30 days um where we say that I, uh, we have our check-ins yeah sorry is Haley maxwell on duty right now it doesn't usually come around on weekends i uh I would like to have this conversation with you, but I will be honest, I kind of want the lieutenant here for it as well, but I need to have a talk with the lieutenant one-on-one -on -one, uh, before we have that conversation. Uh, is there any way that, would you mind if I took some time to speak with Vivian and then the three of us can talk together about uh, what you have in mind for the training program uh i'm more than happy to do that but uh i also feel like this isn't like a shift one particular thing right it would have to be a general for the whole of lspd right so um but yeah i mean more than happy to have this conversation after okay uh i appreciate that let me find ventura uh um is and there, uh any anything else that is there anything that about? you need from um uh, from me or other members of command for shift one say that one more time uh is there anything that you might need from me or members of uh shift one command Not at this time. Uh, keep operating as uh, as usual. Um, I, you should know, uh, there is the ch assistant chief of police position is currently open. Uh, I will be speaking to a number of people about the position um, over, you know, the next week or two. I would also like to speak with you, Anita, about it. Okay. And uh, right now, uh, Ruby York has been moved to senior officer uh, <laughs> until, you know, I look at the command structure and see how things fit. Uh, mm -hmm. And that is what I have to say about that. Okay. 
Um, all right. Uh, just one thing, and this is something that um, I, I I actually want legitimately your opinion on this because this is something that I asked High Command to do, and there was nothing done about it. Um, we had to fire an officer for um evidence tampering, basically MDT corruption. Um, I was told which, about this last night. Yeah, and um, because of that. His partner on duty also quit, and now there's a lot of speculation about what happened and so on. But there is like a case in the docket and everything, and I personally, I I feel like when things like had like this happened, I feel like we need to be more clear with the rest of the police department. There was no announcements, there was no clarifications on anything, and so on. I don't think it should come from. Who, I, I, um, who was in charge or who made that decision? Uh, of firing him. We did like uh it was myself, Viv, the assistant chief of police Ruby York, and chief of police Eric Johnson. We were all there. We all agreed with the firing. And uh are you familiar with the entire situation? Uh, I am, yes. All right. Uh can you can you tell me what happened exactly? Um uh as in like what the he did and then the conversations that we had after? Yeah. So basically what did he do? And what was the exact reason uh, for firing him? Okay. So, okay, what did he do? He, um, one of our um, sergeants at the time, Sergeant Slags in the, in the BCSO, um, is also the director of the CIB unit, so the detective unit that has been disbanded now. Um, he told Riker uh, to um, put a SIM card and go through the phone. Um, Riker had uh, questions about this SIM card, but he still went ahead and he did it and he started going through like the contacts and so on. Then he realized that this wasn't some random um, phone, phone, uh, phone SIM, ah, SIM card, sorry. And um, he then questioned if they had consent or if they needed a subpoena. Um, and that's when uh, Slack said that um, they either had consent or they didn't have consent or they needed consent or something like that. Let me. Um, it was something like along those lines, I'm trying to remember everything by heart. Um, here, yeah. Um, then that happens. Um, like Riker questioned himself, like if there was a subpoena. There was like consent or anything like that. And then he, when he found out that the phone was from Tilly, apparently he asked for consent to go to, to the phone, but then Tilly, re, Tilly told him that they couldn't go through the phone. Um, and that made it like very um, odd there in the situation. Um, now um, we went, uh, I have a command report that I think I did. Yeah, here we go. Um okay. then when we he then got pulled up to the marshal's office and he had um he had a uh, interrogation with Marshal Pred that uh, he has been fired now but uh during this interrogation uh Riker lied um he uh, he said that he never went through the phone. Um, he, um, he he was trying to cover himself up, right? Um, he said that he hadn't touched that report in a long time. And that um, he couldn't remember the, the things that happened. But then we went to check the logs of the report. And the day before, he had, had added his statement into the report, right? So he, he lied on that, right? When we asked him about that, right? How, how you're saying that you couldn't remember when you added a report, uh, a statement into this report the day before. He said he couldn't remember. He said he doesn't remember it. He then started saying that if it was another Marshall, that it would have been different because Marshall Pred really uh, made him feel like a criminal and that he... Unfortunately, um, 
was too nervous and didn't react in the best way and so on. Uh, we then questioned him about why didn't he came to other members of command about the conduct from Sergeant Slacks, um, about, you know, if the fact that he knew that there was no consent to go to, to, to the SIM card. Um, Sergeant Slacks also denied the FOIA request from that report that Riker was the one that notified him about it. Um, this FOIA was denied by being an active investigation, but Riker knew that it wasn't being worked on, right? Then he also didn't brought that any of that to any members of command and so on. Um, then after this whole interrogation with um, Fred, Riker changed the statement again. Um, it wasn't like massive changes and so on, but he changed the, the statement, changed the report. Uh, and then that's when he he provided a report on, on a FOIA. Um, when we confronted Riker about all of these things, he admitted that he had twisted things. Um, the way that he said it uh, to, to Pred and how he was trying to, in a way, cover what happened. Um, and most of the time he was just claiming that he didn't remember it um or that he didn't that he had forgot about it um and after that whole conversation with all of the members of command and i command we thought that his conduct was very questionable um he is facing felony charges right now from the the marshal's office um trying to um trying to see the timeline that Angel made. Uh, yeah, he on like a few days after um yeah, if, so four days after he was interviewed by Pred, he then like amended his statement to um to remove things of his previous statement and to twist a little bit of things. Um, so, for example, uh, Riker removed the following sections from his statement. Riker placed the SIM into his phone. Then Riker then removed the SIM from his phone and handed it back to Slacks. And then he amended Tilly's consent in the statement from full consent to just consent. So he purposely went back on the statement that he had made and then changed back to these things. Even though he was always claiming that he didn't remember. Um, then um, he decided to come clean to command. Um, he decided to come clean to command like hours after, uh, Marshall Angel, uh, interrogated like two people about this case. It was literally like mere hours, um, within, within it. So, yeah, it was, um, a lot of, I don't remember, it's not taking accountability. Uh, we started questioning him. And his credibility as an officer and then um if this was a mistake that he would have admitted from the beginning and told us and not trying to twist things in a way that it felt like he wasn't trying to cover for him or cover himself and so on he would have very easily probably got out of the si whole situation without a dab right or with the dab or like a suspension or something like that he held up all of this information, everything that was happening, and he only came clean to command weeks after all of this happened. And between that and the conduct that he had during this whole situation, we didn't felt like we could trust him as a as an officer, as an FTO, as a detective, and so on. Well, uh, it sounds like the termination was very valid. Um, what I would say to that is, um, going back to accountability, uh, that is, that is a requirement of the job, uh, is that you have to be accountable as a police officer, uh, trying to, you know, things happen, mistakes happen, uh, I think mistakes, you know, they be dealt with on a one-on-one -on -one basis and you move forward with from them. 
uh, unless, you know, you're purposefully doing something or, you know, it's, it's corrupt in some way. Um, I wouldn't really call that a mistake. I would, I would call that a decision more than anything. Um, you know, it's, uh, these things happen, but to then not take accountability for it, to seemingly make the situation much more complicated and difficult um and now he's facing felony charges for it is that right uh, yes he is i i would say that an announcement does need to be put out uh just reiterating to officers basically what i said you know if if uh, they make a mistake bring it to your superior immediately address it, get it handled and move on. Um, I don't want officers to be afraid to come to command um, with issues, whether they're good or bad. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people do come to command for mistakes that they make. Like we're, we're all humans, so we're all going to make mistakes. No one is perfect, no matter what. Not one person in this police is perfect not even commend we're all you know sometimes commit mistakes too it happens is again accountability it's in the way that we handle things and do things um he um he again uh i don't know what's your stand on this um but we have a 30 days reapplication um um where where someone if so if someone was fired they can apply within 30 days we have brought back some people that had been fired in the past, such as uh, it was Gregory Johnson and Dental Shiesty. They had been fired in the past and they did. I think they were away for like 30 days and then came back and, you know, they've completely changed their attitudes and they've done for the best. Um, but I would say that this is this has a little, a little bit of a long way to go. He's still facing felony charges and yeah, the whole thing. Were the other two fired because of attitude, or...? Um... I don't remember. I... Sorry, it's been so long. I I legitimately do not remember. There's... It's probably somewhere in the command reports or anything like that. Maybe even in the high command reports. I don't... I mean, you might have access to those. Um... Because other than that, I don't remember i think gregory johnson was very heavy on his attitude and he was very disrespectful and so on i think denzel was just a little bit of like um i think it came down to like uh a lot of mistakes and lack of judgment in certain things um i I don't even think I was command or a senior when Denzel got let go at the time. And maybe even Johnson. So yeah, that's that's how long it has been. And they're still both hired and you know, Denzel is driving right now with TRT, so No, I'm I'm not questioning really uh their you know being rehired. It's fine. Um you know and I'm not going to question that. I, I guess I just, I was curious um, because this doesn't really sound like an issue with attitude. Um, oh, no, no, not at all. This is a little bit more serious, in my opinion. The whole modifying um, statements for his own. Yeah, not good. I, I think we cross that bridge when it gets, when we come to mm -hmm. it. Uh, you know, I, I do think that, you know, second chances, uh, he says, you know, a lot of people, um, but they have to understand and take accountability for their original actions. And I think that'll probably be the kind of determining factor mm -hmm. in my opinion. Yep. Because in 30 days, if he's still, you know, 
not taking accountability for it, well, maybe needs yeah. a little bit more time. Yeah, probably. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Again, when whenever we get there, I don't think it's going to be anytime soon. But um, I don't know. If you want us to write up something, it's been like days to the, it's it's been like almost a week a week now. Not not like but at least five days as long since it's happened. Just like I me personally, I hate I and I'm gonna be very honest with you, like even the new announcement for you as a chief of police and so on. Um there's I don't nothing. Think there is an announcement. Yeah, there is I, nothing. Uh, no, I I have not put an announcement. Uh Nino was going to do, I think, a public announcement uh, when I was ready. I wanted to basically speak to people one-on-one, -on -one, uh, you know, kind of slowly inform the police department, allow people some time to take it in and to approach me uh, before it's basically publicly announced. Um News the traveled officers, really fast. I, I, uh, I, I'm I, sure it did. I'm sure it did. It, it, but... Listen, I woke up, I walked into the meeting room, and I got approached and told about you. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I am sure, you know, it. it's new. Uh, I am new. People don't know me. Uh, I would have been surprised if people were not talking about it. Yeah, of and... course. I mean... It's like I told you, like, I was very surprised about you because, one, um, honestly... I didn't I work here. Yeah, I, I don't know you, right? Um, the thing is, the decision is made. It doesn't matter what people say or what we do and so on. This is a decision and you are the chief now, right? Um, so this is what we live in and this is what we have to adapt to. Um, so... Uh, but yeah, I mean, there there was a lot of conversation within uh, uh, once Nino was appointed and so on. Um, all I can tell and and say to you is best of luck. I hope you do just for what the LSPD needs. Um, but uh, yeah, some some, some uh, starting it with some communication and um. Showing that you care for everybody to hear it and know it from, you know, a valuable source is a good point. Absolutely. I mean, I, um, you know, uh, under speaking with everybody and understanding where everybody comes from, uh, what officers are excelling at versus what they're struggling with, I think will only allow me to make better and informed decisions that will help will help officers succeed. I, uh, like I said, I'm I'm here for you. I'm here to support you. I'm here to give you what you need to succeed. People just, you know, and need to talk to me and tell me what they need. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, may I ask, um, what is generally your, um, what would be your time focus on duty and so on? And I'm asking this just to know, like, the crossover and so on for whenever I would want to bring things to you. On the weekends, I plan to be around earlier in the day, you know, shift one into shift two. Uh, you know, I'm going to try to stop into shift three as much as I can. It is, you know, very, mm -hmm. very late for me, yeah, though. Very but aware of I, I also don't want them. While I know, well, I've heard shift three is doing very well. And they do. They really do. And they, they seem like they, they kind of got everything handled. I, I still don't want them to feel like an island. I don't want them to feel like uh, they don't have any high command presence in their shift. Yeah. Um, during the weekdays, I will probably be around primarily during shift two. Okay. Um, talking about shift three, if I may give you my, my, my perspective and so on, because I know a lot of them and so on. I feel like they work very well because they have a very strong and structured team, right? But they also 
you don't see as much as a department divide as you see on other shifts. And again, th this the difference is shift three when it comes down to like numbers of them all together, right? It ends up being a little bit shorter than the rest of the shifts, but then we end up lacking more units. It it's a whole thing, right? But they just work really well and their hiring, their academies and everything is all done together. So they have a lot of more people to Shift bounce up Sky and help each me. other. Yeah. So it, it works it works really well between them and so on. Um I do I do want to ask, and again, this is none of my business, right? But oh I'm so sorry. Oh Jesus. <laughs> oh I'm sorry. It's, a, it's all right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Do you need an eye pack? Glasses. You need an eye pack? <laughs> sorry. Oh, I got one. You're good, okay. Oh, sorry. Um, That's all right. Would you consider uh, a captain in shift three? Yes, actually. Okay. Um, I, one thing I did speak with Sky about is that she would like a uh, high command presence in shift three. Uh, whether that ends up being the assistant chief or a captain, uh, I do want to see that every shift has a high command member. Okay. Yeah. Um, listen, I told Beric months ago to give Captain to Viv so that we could have that on shift one. Because when Cassidy went uh, to the BCSO as on the other sheriff, they were very focused on building up the BCSO, which is very fair, right? They're building up a department from scratch, right? So even though we had high command in shift one, uh, the representation wasn't like fully there in a way. But um, I I do like that perspective. I don't feel like we need high command 24-7 every day of the week, right? But there is a lot of things that even us as command um, need high command review and they might just stay pending for days because it's either very rare when people check the reports that we put in or it's hard to get in a conversation with uh with them nope that is fair um is there are there any any fires right now that you are dealing with that you need me to look at uh i wouldn't say so i listen i was on um i i was out of the city for weeks i only came back like last friday so um i wouldn't say anything we had an academy during this weekend the past weekend um it went well um really good uh i would say that we are lacking seniors like we need in and, and, one. yes but here's the thing though i'm not gonna tell you like oh we need we need seniors and i want x y and z as seniors and so on um the reason why we're lacking seniors is because we are lacking to see that sparkle from people to push and be better Nobody, and to be an example uh, and yeah that step up right people a lot of people are under the idea that you go out there uh you you do your job as a patrol officer and you lead a couple of scenes and so on that you should automatically be a senior um i don't Fully believe in that i feel like being a senior is much more than objectively doing what you're expected to do in the field um uh, it's being a senior is dealing with people yeah people and the, the people within our department like even like the training and bringing them up and helping and things like that and identifying where things are failing and being that step up right so um <laughs> Yeah, I, I would say like that's that's something that we are struggling. I feel like Haley is, um, she's the only senior. I'm so sorry. They they have to be training the canines or something outside. Yeah, Maya. Yeah, it's please. all right. It's all right. Um, canine. Yes, please give us canine. Canine. <laughs> uh, it's been it's been a conversation for a while. Uh, Beric did told us that it was a few uh, months away still. There's still a lot of work be done around mission row before but um i mean if you do want to inquire about it uh it doesn't hurt at least for you to get um and i mean if i go yeah. yeah exactly um maya 
go to bed. I, I don't feel like, uh, I feel like the detective unit and so on, um, is very, this is my opinion, but I feel like it's very hard to put a detective unit up and running when we are still struggling with certain points of control at times, so, um, but yeah, other than the lack of seniors for shift one, I wouldn't say like there's any massive fires that need to be put up, put out. At least that I have no of. Uh, Kidneys, there, there was. Um, what uh -huh. I would say about the seniors is, um, give me some time. I need to look at the command structure in each shift. Um, see if and what changes need to be made. Um, once that is sorted out. Uh, then we can take a look at the, the seniors. Yeah, that's fair. Um, just to give you some context, Nakoda is out of city. He should be back either this weekend or beginning of, um, this week. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Uh, do you have any questions for me? I've been here for a while. Might be able to help or, um, make you understand anything if you no, have like any questions no, i think uh i think i'm okay uh you know i do want to say that i do understand how surprising the situation probably is to everyone uh you all are have been in the department for a long time uh and to have somebody who was i was a part of the skeleton crew you know oh okay um, and then uh, I I had to go back home to deal with some personal family issues, but um, I do understand that this is this is definitely an odd situation, and that you know just just don't don't worry, you know. I I I assume that there are people that are already kind of. The doom concerned yeah, yeah yeah like i said um it doesn't matter how much people complain or anything like that the decision is done we just need to adapt to it um that's kind of how i follow listen years ago um i would, would have probably doomed and so on but um i would say like i've matured the mo the, the the longer that i've found myself in uh situations um like this where things just change very drastically and the best thing that we can do is just adapt to it i've been through a lot of restructures and changes and high commands changes and so on throughout my career so i i am very much aware of what all of this means okay uh well i appreciate your time thank you so much anita um no problem. Uh, again, if you do need anything or anything like that, do let me know. Um, and um, I wish you the most of luck. Um, and that, um, that things go well. I mean, it's your first day, so there's going to be a lot of like meetings and so on for you that I expect. Oh, yeah. Uh, I... Uh... I think that the person I need to speak to next is Vivian, uh, which I don't know where she is. Probably might on, be the on the 78. call. But then again, I don't know what my assistant has scheduled for me. Um. Yeah. Yeah. The Ventura is um. The Ventura. <laughs> He's a good uh, one. I was told that Vivian has a meeting in December, has an has availability for a meeting in December of 2025. What? Wait, who was that Ventura that told you that? Apparently Vivian's assistant, Peach. Oh the, oh P oh. Said that she's available in December. Okay. Um, hello? Yes. Hello, Michael.
Yes. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you so much. All right, bye-bye. Huh. Summer 2025. Okay. Interesting. Um, can I just uh, give you just a couple of uh, things that I feel like could take a look at and so on very quickly when it comes down to like SOPs and such? Um, sure. It's more like under the DAP list and so on. Um, I sometimes uh, is this in the actual SOP document? The actual SOPs, yeah, yeah, the actual SOPs document and so on. Like sometimes there's, um, how do I say this? Like there's, there's, in, like for example, someone forgets to charge someone for a hot gun and so on, right? Uh, me and Viv were going through through it and um. We felt like nothing under the one dabs, for example, felt, you know, felt like it fit. Um, I don't know if this just needs to be reviewed, maybe or evaluated or something like that. Um, but sometimes we find ourselves in these situations where, um, like the neg like uh, negligence, but wasn't you know. Negligence that wasn't like on purpose and so on falls under like three dabs, which would be something that falls under the um, this again, not charging someone for a hot gun and then just giving them three dabs for that, which still is something very serious, right? But like with five dabs, they get uh, like you know. I, I don't know. It's a it's a recommendation if you want to review review it and maybe I I haven't checked this in a while. Um, uh, but a while back the roles could do some could do with some working, especially when it was to guide people like oh I want to be a senior oh I want to be a sergeant and so on right. So. Uh, I, That's something that you're I willing to work on on that... review. We need, uh, I need to speak with you. I need to speak with the other sergeants, lieutenants, and senior officers and hear out what their day-to-day -day responsibilities are and if that is reflected within the guidelines on the SOPs and they probably should be amended. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Um, you know, the SOPs are there to, you know, guide us but also they need to be a reflection of the actual work that everyone is putting in yes um plus if uh, we want. as far as the daps go um i'll take a look at that i'll think about the procedure that makes sense to be put in place you know i think while uh, so that would be you know essentially failure to submit evidence uh because they didn't run the gun uh and then from there probably charges were impressed um uh i mean i'll have to think about it you know if it's a one-off thing if you know the officer has always run the gun in the past and for whatever reason they didn't run it this time i think it's probably worth a conversation if it is something that is a continued issue Ooh. uh then you know <clears throat> i think we would have to address it as such i think there's a difference between you know rushing and making a mistake um and then a repeated pattern okay all right i um you know i i I don't want to be too, I will be honest with you, I don't want to be too focused on the disciplinary side at this moment. I just kind of want to be looking at the PD as a whole, looking at the people within it, um, how those people operate, and, you know, the 
discipline or that I think will that will be addressed just it need, I need some time yeah that's fine again I I was just bringing it up because it was something that I identified a while back also and what I will say mm -hmm. is I trust your judgment I trust uh you know you are a command member and I think as long as you can articulate it and you can explain your reasoning, uh, I trust whatever punishment or disciplinary action uh, you give out. Okay. And yeah. until sure. um, procedures are changed, just uh, I would say continue on as you have. If you need my advice, if there's something that's big or you're just not sure how to handle it, just, just bring it to me and we'll talk about it. Okay. All right. Sounds good. I'm fine with I, that. Uh, yeah, I I want you to feel ownership of your position as a sergeant. I you've been doing it a while. Uh, I don't think I need to micromanage you. Uh, yeah, I I don't think you have to do that too. Um, it, it was more just um, uh, an opportunity to be reviewed there for sure. And I absolutely will review it. Yeah, that's fine. Um, okay. Uh, anything else that you would like to talk? We're good. I think we're good. Okay. Uh, just, you know, if there's anything else you want to talk about, just reach out. Uh, can I get your phone number, please? Of course. This way, I will, I'll just text you. There you go. 425-259476. Okay, all right. Uh, I will text you, and um, this way, if you also need anything, you can contact me. Chief Daisy. And your last name is Moss, right? Is it that is correct. Uh, okay, all right. And you should have got that. I did, thank you. Okay, all right, sounds good. Uh, if you ever want to talk, whenever, again, take your time, uh, get used to, get to know people and so on. Uh, but whenever you want to talk about like any of the hiring things and so on, anything that we can do to fresh up the shift and so on like that, um, yeah, just let me know. I think that we things are a little bit easier now, and I kind of wanted to approach that to bring in some different ways of bringing people in say that one more time all right i was saying uh i think that things are a little bit better behind hiring so i kind of just wanted to do other things to freshen up things freshen up cadets freshen up our application absolutely so, um yeah. you know if if you want to make changes to like i said the the recruiting strategy, I think that's great. Um, I do want to speak to you about it more in depth. Uh, I just feel that, you know, after, not on radio right now, but after this situation with the 78s is resolved, uh, I really need to speak with Vivian. Yeah. yeah regardless yeah. of whether or not she's only available in a year and a half. <laughs> yeah, that's... um. I mean, something that you need to know about Peach, though. She's um, she, she's a funny gal. She's she's a funny gal. Might I don't know. Might I I don't know. I don't know. I really truly don't know. Yeah, I mean, maybe she got the month wrong in the year. You know, it's maybe maybe she misheard it. Also, Could have been. possibly yeah. <laughs> Okay, uh, right. yeah, I'm gonna go and patrol. All right, uh, stay safe if you go out there, uh, and if not, have a, a good um, day at Mission Row. So East Bound Route 68, crossing Buena Vino. I appreciate it. No problem. Have a good one. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Shad, I need to actually have dinner. God so damn. East Bound 68, crossing Zancuda Road, primary. Alright, 272 secondary, eastbound, round 68. That bug? 
for that voice in ages. Do I fear? This badge is hiring officers for this badge. Wow. Wow. Uh, back, uh, back, thank oh, you so much. Eastbound. Thank you so much for the tier 1 subby for 22 months. Whoa. My tertiary is attached, and then you're in another, in another vehicle, right? Yeah, A firm. I didn't look in front of me. <laughs> My bad. They think it's a bug. Uh, uh, has your communications. We're going to left northbound, uh, just your road. Are you doubled up? Uh, negative. Mm -hmm. Roger, Dodger. We're going to okay. be now merging eastbound on Joshua Road. Approaching the first My left husband got me a kid's Marina meal. Drive. Awesome. But it's Burger King. No, no. So it's ew. No, it's... Shit, no, if no, gears up my ass. No, no, no. Approaching eastbound Joshua Road. Approaching the split uh, for San Andreas. Hey, honey. Uh, wait, oh, hi. Hi. You're tuning in. Why do Shiro. I have? Oh, thank you. you heard him on the radio. Doing Eastbound. this before I ask. Here you go. Thank you. I need it. No problem. But I'm going to be approaching the front of the BCSO. I'll stand in front of the BCSO. This is not right my right cheese, but more. Breaking, 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 breaking. Right, southbound, off road. And then towards. Oh, check. Um, oh, we still have it. We still have it. We have four included. Can we get a dispatch? Can you turn off for this, please? Uh, yeah, report yeah, 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 three for three, Chad. This is not my cheeseburger, this is chicken double. nuggets. I I hate salty chicken nuggets, and this is literally what it is. Ugh, a primary doubled or negative? The channel three, channel three, three five three ten forty two. Good night. In. Bro. I've been given information about a race that's about to start by the apartments in Lozol. My kids' menu. Why does my Coke taste like perfume? <laughs> Cherry, you never I'm call upset. me bad. No, I listen. I just finished my meeting upset? now. I just finished okay. my meeting now, and I'm eating, okay? And I ordered okay. a kid's cheeseburger, okay? They gave me chicken nuggets, and I'm very unhappy right now, Sherry, okay? So don't you start, okay? Well, your chief already started it, so I might just end it. Do you want to be Marshall? <laughs> listen, it's day one, okay? Just let it breed, okay? Sure about that, bud. Yeah, I'm sure about it. It's fine. What's that? What's that one? Hundred percent. You okay with that? Do you allow me to be a trooper? Can I be like a trooper, a marshal trooper? Oh, there is no marshal trooper. Bus there bus is no trooper. Then make the troopers. Let me patrol. And be a marshal. Two four five. Who has okay, the you know what? Why don't you come speak to Angel about it? Because that's something six, quite above uh, my pay grade. I'm just poaching here, okay? Oh, perfect. Thank you very oh. much. Well, that's my terms for poaching. Okay. Well, how about you come to the office, speak to Angel, say, I want to be marshaled, but this is something that I'm going to go patrol. Okay, future. okay you can be outside and do investigations. Uh, okay, how about that? Ten cars right now? About the same. You know what? You deserve her. Goodbye.
1338 westbound on the Del Piero Freeway on ramp by Movie Star Way. It's going to be a black and red Dragar, three times occupied. Meh. Meh, sure. Oh, shit. Sorry, I alt tabbed on Discord. This is my husband. Boom. Bro, this fucking drink tastes like shit too. Six oh six ten seven food court. Alpha sixty two seventy six central hospital is forty seven from Sandy area. That's true. Where's Duncan? I'm gonna be very blunt with you. I'm sorry, but both me and Dale were not considering. <laughs> Hello. Hey boss, I'm at a, I'm at a PD now. Hey Nita. Oh fuck, I need to feed my um. Okay, I need to give food to Maya. Give me a second. Maya. It's okay, Shad. It's okay, Shad. We, I have very tiny. Uh, I have a very tiny white, white chocolate and something else. Kit Kat. And I bought it in a Korean shop downtown London. Six oh nine, back ten eight. Any active? Not on main frequency. Six oh six, ten eight. Dispatch to fifty ten eight. What is this? What is this car? Coming at twenty ten eight. 
Dispatch from 256 to 99 Bravo. What is wrong with this car? This shit is going fast as fuck. What the fuck is this? Please eat. I ate some of the chicken I eat. Twenty-three, two miles, nine one. Thirty-eight westbound, up to Freeman Code four one one. Dispatch two fifty twenty-three to nine Bravo. Code six. No, I ate some of them, just not very, you know. Was it 609, I'm going to be issuing a traffic citation down here at the uh, closed off of Innocence Boulevard. 1576. Where's that firearm call? It's on the weed things? It is. Fifty Denny. Coming at twenty seventy six to at least now one. Coming at twenty seventy six to the nine one one. And by the way, I don't think we're going to win the KC game, so we might be second. Okay. Dispatch 250 to catch up. White and colored vehicle, East Van Howick Avenue. Beating, driving on opposite lanes of travel. Pull over! Jesus Christ! Oh, no. Oh, no. no. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Come on, engine off, on. windows down. Come on, let's go. Come on, engine off! <laughs> Dispatch 250, 1038 northbound Elgin Avenue, Wine and Color Premier. It's occupied four times. Can I have 77s? <laughs> no. Route to uh, the other 30. I'm going to go over to Anita. Yep. Cross this Mirror Park Boulevard. Um, Sergeant Anita Mayo with Los Santos Police Department. How you doing? Hello, how's it going? Hey, seven. we have in the car. Seven what? Seven. We have a mouse. I'm seven. You have a seven, mouse? One, two, six, okay. Eight, nine, nine, eight. You're you're a mouse. You're a mouse. Yeah. Oh, what do you have in your hands, mouse? It's a TV. That's a TV. Brand new TV. Just copped it, you know. A TV. That doesn't look like a TV. Yeah, he wouldn't know a TV. Would you mind stepping away from the car and letting me see that? Hell no. No, it's my what? TV. 
Too late. That no, doesn't look like a TV. Have you seen every TV ever made? Twenty-five, twenty-four, nine, one. Have you ever seen like those nineteen ninety? Where's the? That's what it is. What? Yeah. Warm's here. Fuck. Wait, wait. Ah! Hey! Don't hit me with things. A rocket arm. What the heck? Yeah, Warm cereal is great, They're okay? Really, You're just really a hater. Warm cereal is trash. It's disgusting. What? Warm cereal is great. It's gross. No, it's not. Come on, driver. I need your drivers in line at the re reservation. Might please. as well have. Depends on the cereal. What, 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 I don't have one. You don't have a license. I don't. Then how do I know who I'm talking to? It's Rob, I'm Rob Long. Long. You're Rod Long? If someone has eyes, yeah. someone in the vehicle flash. is going to be a white van okay, with a ladder on right. top of it. Do you have a digital license you can show me? Southbound Dutch London Street. My oh, phone's out of battery. Your phone is out of... Does anyone have a phone that I could borrow here, Mr. No, Rod on, Long? I actually have a picture of his ID. I can send it to you. Hold on. You have a picture of his ID? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Sure, send it to me. Should I expect like a Hold text on. message? Uh, the well, 1080s currently going sure east of Dutch London Street. If any CVPIs on oh. channel one want to get involved, 646. Um, this is just a digital note saying I am Rod Long. I mean, that's that's identifying me, right? Yeah, 20. that's true. This is no, I mean, no, found El the ID has you know your date of birth, your full name. What, what is it, the definition yeah. of ID? It's identification, a right? Government that, that identifies him. A government identification. Him can, can you read us what ID is in the legislation? The northbound Elysian Fields Freeway. I no, I cannot read you what ID is Why on not? the legislation. You if you read? have, oh my God, if you, I'm so if, sorry if you have you. a question about any of the legislation that is put in place, you can actually access it yourself in the city hall. Driver, I need your tablet. license registration. Don't you don't need it. We're uh, asking you. They'll give you a so tablet in the city hall. The what the heck? Or we could just ask you. You're the Olympic one that forces it. Why can't you tell us what it is? Well, sure. is a government issued identification that is provided to you. You're gonna. You're. You do have a license in your phone. Yeah, I have a digital. I just plugged in my phone. Well, hold on. Oh, okay. Correct lanes or. And I have kind of shook in my ankles. Still going westbound on the freeway though. Six oh nine. I'm gonna be back ten eight. I just ruined a man's life. Ten four. Hold on. I'm trying to find him. Uh huh. Becca, can I get you to attach to this uh, ID, please? Hey, firm. What's the twenty? Or on Vespucci Boulevard. Oh. Secretary's got your cause. We're currently in a pursuit. Oh God, damn it! They're taking off. Westbound. Oh, up freaking freeway. that man. Ah. <sighs> 609 to 76, latest 80. Continue. Westbound to Freeway approaching the colorful <laughs> garage exit. Taking the colorful garage exit, stand by for direction. It'd be your own shot. It'd be your own. Left, southbound, North Rockford Drive. Left, eastbound, San Andreas. Need to make him re. Oh, okay. Two eastbound, San Andreas. Street. 50, we have a secondary 80 happening on Elgin Avenue. Dispatch, can we get a channel for the site? We've got four units now. Channel 2 for the 99. Sure. Atham, white van, channel 2, white van, channel 2. Okay, alright. The secondary 80, uh, Marcus just crashed. I'm gonna check on him. You okay? I'm, I'm good, I'm okay. I'm okay, okay. We're a VCB on the white and color premiere. It was last seen going south on an Elgin. Fun? Get a repair kit. Uh, I should have an extra, yes. Just repair it and I do have an extra one. Here. I need a new bike. I need a new bike. He needs a new one? Sorry, a bike? I need a new bike. What's the point of having a bike if I can't cleanly follow someone up a hill? I don't understand. I get the whole bike parallels 
also need a bike that can keep up with other bikes. We used to have sports bike. God, I wish. It wasn't like fully sports sports bikes, but yeah. Ah, yeah. Stop. Yeah, but I bet they could keep up with almost anything. Hey. Holy Maya, Jesus fucking Christ. I used to ride a really nice bike. It was like hey. kind of off roady, but it was still super sporty. Yeah, I think that's Wheelie. kind of what we had, maybe. The wheelie and shit. And I could keep <laughs> up with really hard. Just put that bitch in turbo mode and I'll zoom it. And now I gotta ride a Harley in 2020. Yep. I hate it here. Oh, God damn it! I have to block my internet cables or Maya just bites them. Hey there, Miss Cage. How can I help you? I didn't know you couldn't read, bro. What do you mean I can't read? Are you I don't want to read a legend. I don't want to open a tablet and give you the definition of, uh, of an ID in the middle of a traffic stop when it's just me and another person. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> Miss Cage, Miss Cage, Miss Cage. Do you want to read me whatever it says now? Why don't you get yourself into the city hall and read the legislation that we have in place? Or mm -hmm. I could talk that, huh? to somebody, you know, and just like ask them and they could like communicate that to me instead of looking at a tablet. I feel like that would be the better choice. Miss Cage, that's, that's, that just only shows that you're being lazy. It shows that you're being lazy. You don't want to read it either. I'm two, working also, right you now. Can't read. Yes, I can read. Okay, read me something. What do you want me to read? Oh. I don't know. Just read anything. Um. Hey, okay, sure. Uh, Carmela Crescent on Twitter a minute ago. Just got dumped because I'm too horny. What the fuck? Oh, you can read. Yeah, I can read. I know, right? Great. Wow. Well. You like my TV? That is fine. Those were not TVs. Those were it was contraband. A TV. It was a TV. It's an art TV. Like an art deco TV. Don't help. I gotta go. I, you want I a TV? I'm gonna chase. I wanna chase. I gotta go. Bye. Okay, don't crash. Dispatch to 50, 1080, blocking color Sentinel, eastbound Sentinel, Reyes. Vehicle is flagged on 60, occupied one times. Passing Mission Road, southbound Center Street. Passing 77 for 80, right westbound on Zabal Boulevard. Left southbound, uh, Strawberry Avenue, crossing under Olympic. Passing Strawberry Gas Station. Ride westbound and since Boulevard. Ride northbound power. Crossing under Olympic. Crossing the switchy. Merging onto upper power. I just got hit by a bike. I'm okay. Vehicle has been last seen going upper power. PCB. God fucking damn it.
How the fuck? I don't know. Oh, okay. Now I'm just being bullied. status check I'm Russian king trying to flip my vehicle um 250 any available 10 8 units to help me and flip my vehicle on power and the switchy I'm stuck in a wall uh, and I cannot do anything On the way, I need a at MRPD. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> oh. This bash to twenty show channel three collapsed. UTL get the vehicle though. Ten seven. Hey. Okay. okay. Thank you. Alright. 50 to Taco Bear. I'm good. Someone help me. Firm. Firm. Was that a Taurus? T8 unit is needed on channel 2, please. T8 unit channel 2. EMS from PD. The Freemus. Downed individual. I have a 13 Bravo Integrity Way and uh, Del Piero Freeway. A uh, lower. Bravo 62 and right. No! Dispatch 272 10 8. Bark, I need you on channel 2, please. Got a pursuit. Need help. Perseverance. Uh, copy. Uh, switching channel two. The fifties and eight. Jesus. We made seventy sevens on this. Upper yeah. lower. All right, copy. I'm ten seconds out, dog. All right, uh, here come my vehicle's damaged. Here you want to take primary? Headed the vehicle. You got a premier right behind you. 250 on freak. Do you need more 77s? Ah, uh, yes, please. We have uh, we Funny. have an interference. They're currently in in the Integrity Way tunnel. White van and a premier that keeps changing colors. Going for box, keep the premier away. This pink one trying to guide it into the wall. Oh pink one is interference. The van is what we're after. Hey firm. Myself and Buck will focus on premier. Has the premier been warned about pits and so on? It's been worn plenty of times. My vehicle is disabled. I repeat, my vehicle is disabled. White Bagaro is also involved as well. Mm. 
square one going with the Bravo to CMC. White Vigar and the Premier is following the truck best on the City Boulevard. Go around. I'm stuck on this pole. Yep. Fizzy still has eyes on the Ven and the Vigaro, where Westbound has double Boulevard. Fizzy, Savage, Savage? He on standby, Jack. Um, there's a big car following the chase, by the way. If from plenty of times it goes at any up to the high speed, it'll be hard. They've been warned, yeah. Oh, go for box here, go for bo box here. It's a 20 at a suit. In the, uh, the, the Olympic freeway squeeze, uh, right near the VU. Or set fire top six for cars. Uh, the the passenger's about to get out and try to escape. Uh, this car. Run off foot. She's jumping out the back. The passenger's jumping out the back. Uh, I'm gonna give the passenger space to just get in the Vigero and get out of here. I, I don't particularly care about the passenger. Yeah, we're gonna we'll let them out. They're back on. I will to cancel that. Going through Western Alley. All right, buddy. Guys, sorry about that. Coming on to Alta Street northbound. Northbound Alta Street. Repeat as soon as I get a secondary unit behind me. You have the premier behind you too. Yeah, that premier pitted me at a 120 plus incapacitating my FTO. Hey. Do I just shoot him? Okay, did that Don't. pit just oh, happen? They're, they're, they're stuck. They're oh, stuck. they're stuck in front of a sandy truck. Ooh, ooh back up. <laughs> they are not. He's getting blocked by a truck. Try to block this exit. Be aware of the civilians there. Do not put them at risk at all. He's getting blocked by a trash truck. Come on, get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna do anything. I'm just watching this idiot we, trying to get through the trash truck. We got it boxed with a sandy truck. <laughs> I can't believe the trash. Do not let loose. Why is that truck here? Why is that truck there? there? Two seven two is gonna stay mobile uh, northbound on Palomino, right where the sandy truck is at. Oh my god. Oh, Back it up! <laughs> Get off that car for your own safety! He just hit his finish! He just hit it! He hit a sandy worker! He just ran over a sandy worker! Who the fuck just thought? What am I looking at? Why are these idiots? I gave him I gave him a warning. He, if he doesn't stop, we might have to open fire. He just ran over a citizen. Are we open fire on? This is embarrassing. You're getting hurt. You're getting pushed by a van. You guys are getting pushed by a van. Uh, it's a fucking van. What do you want me to do? I'm like a. It's like four Act times like a, my weight. Car. Act like a real car, man. Okay, Alright, the they're, they're, the the they're back on players. They're back on My car smoked out. Someone take primary. Main vehicle is northbound Palomino Ave. Premier has been pitted. It's still mobile. Get out of here! Get out of the scene! If you keep pitting officers, you will be shot at! Alright, the uh, pink premiere is smoking now. Main car is West Rocker Drive. Can some CDPI take over this? I'm smoking, but I'll try. 
Pick up, I gotta get your comms. Well, first if I secondary west, Barker drive. Okay. Left, southbound, Eclipse. Alright, the pick for premieres out on Great Ocean anyway. Pick up westbound Eclipse, taking a jump. Yep, taking a jump. Uh, he landed, he crashed. Can we get a unit to go 15. to Bog? He's out, he's out. The main car is out. No, he's smoking heavy westbound Eclipse. Main car. White yeah, I think Premier's probably repairing on Great Ocean right now. Copy that. They're going southbound Eclipse. Uh, six more six Left. Now. He's bound. Copy that. The PRO, thank you for the service, ma. They got you southbound. The PRO, freeway. you correct out of lane. Another CDPI on this pursuit. Help! This one one is 76 now. With that, uh, Mythic Boys are dressed up Bay City. They are approaching. We're passing Bay City Bank right now. Left is bound. Sandra's up. Jeb is attaching. Copy that, Jeb. Take Go for it. Eastbound, Sandra's up, police Andy going. Oi, take your job to the baseball court. He's gonna end up on Rocket Drive. Uh, yeah, Hi, North Rock. Body committing southbound, uh, uh, Vespucci. Yeah, he's gonna be uh, Vespucci Canals, keeping straight no. on right, the base city. Right, Premier's coming in hot from the base uh, city. I believe he took, I think Boofy he went straight. But yeah, I see yeah, 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 southbound. We're southbound on the uh, on the beach right now. We're on the uh, sidewalk. Southbound. Copy. Oh, left. Eastbound. Follow me now. Right. Magellan. Another left. Eastbound. All right. I've arrived. I'm going to pass on your left when I can. Or do you not smoke in anyways? Here. Bro, these cars are on fucking steroids. Oh my gosh, they might have had a headache. They're out. They're, they're out. out. Individual is on foot. Westbound Palomino Look Avenue, Palomino South Rockford Avenue. Drive. Try to run me over. Oh my God. There's an orange car approaching Palomino Ave side. Westbound. Oh, we got that pink premiere on scene. He's going to get a yeah. in it. I can stay with the car if you guys want to pursue. Copy that. 475 is going to pursue. South Bound Rock Drive. I got one last pit of me all and I'm out. Let, let, me, let me pass you, I'm gonna take primary, I'm not smoking. Start the bundle, shot done. Repair real quick. Okay, copy left, eastbound, Arsenal Street, I'm alone. On the pursuit or what? Just behind you. Copy yeah, this, guy, I guy need like Taurus or Scouts on this. Yeah, yeah, they did. Magic to eastbound, Davis yeah. up. Yeah. Wait, why is there V-Star, they have interceptors? V-Star, what do you mean? Flowing, flowing. Oh, oh no, he's right, 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 Is there a V-Star? Yeah, there is. What's the difference? Yeah, pit the straight, it's gonna um, hit 189 at some point. I think, um, I, I think I'm the V-Star has a better, like, top speed. I don't see him. Oh? Huh? We got, I think, we got the I think V-Star. I think the V-Star has a better top speed than this. Was it, how's it, does it look better? Like yeah, got it, got it, it looks... It does look similar, like, but bond, there's, there's differences, like, say, say down, then 50, it's noticeable difference that you, you know it's not the same car. But yeah, this is like North the normal Signal patrol Street. car, the Taurus, you Opposite know? Side of lane. Oh. Alright, yeah, I, for some Watch reason I thought, like, the V-Star was the interceptor, don't move next time. it says on. interceptor. Um, God damn it. Your right is bound. Yes, uh, um, V-Stars are that, like, um, Command the, Plus and so on. I can actually VCB. drive one. I just, I don't know. I'm just, I have this one. I'm fine uh, with this. You know? VCB, no. Yeah, I feel it. I mean, you yeah. guys are, your cars are pretty good, so. Oh, oh very far. North, oh, northbound yeah, uh, yeah, popular. Northbound popular. Yeah, though, so don't Peak, Peak 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 popular street. This guy's full sending in northbound right now. Right? So. barely oh, got eyes. Okay, eye. okay. If you say so. He went at high rates of speed. Northbound popular street. Uh, VCB. Continuing right, northbound on Elgin Avenue. I flipped! I'm out! Is... I'm out of it! He went, he went on the uh, left, 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 left! I 
I don't know if there's a report for this. Sending in on Harwick, I'll know if he turns left. Do have eyes? Negative. He was on Elgin Nav, he was going left on Spanish Avenue. Last call. I pushed Spanish Avenue, was code 4. I have it, I have it on Clinton, Clinton, Clinton. Shit. He's going should... eastbound on Clinton. U-turning westbound Clinton. Southbound onto uh, Power Street. Right westbound uh, Vinewood. Copy for seven fighters. Left southbound. Out south. uh, the street. Shit. Into ah. Left, southbound, Laguna Pool. It was Mojave Ave. Left, southbound, Las Lagunas Boulevard. Right, westbound. Ah, fuck up. Pass away, he was going up. Oh, he take a jump. He crash, he crash. He crash, he's out, he's out. No, no he's no, still he's moving. No, he's not. He's going southbound, San Vitas. Copy, CDPI is passing on the left. The right, for the right. Take a jump, the pure freeway. The pure freeway is slowing down. Uh, trying to juke. Still can juke eastbound the pure freeway, correct south lane. Slowing. Oh, oh, still fully setting eastbound. There's it's so scouts or Taurus is on this car. I'm right behind you guys. Copy. Okay, east bounce address up left north by Mirror Park Boulevard. Watch your gas station, Mirror Park. Left, westbound, west mirror drive. Bottom Bridge Street. That stay back Slowing, on the van. Left. So good. Westbound. Uh, okay. Just finished documenting. Right. Westbound. Popular Street. Left. Legend. Right. Westbound. The Pierre Freeway. Descending. Taking the exit. I was La Puerta. Tracking a jump. Yeah, he's going all on the exit. Still continuing to his white spot, the pure freeway. 37 on Melon right now. Where are you at, La Perta, you said? Yeah, he's now he is exiting west, uh, right now. Colorful garage, right westbound Rocker Drive, left uh, southbound uh, Red Desert up, left uh, okay. eastbound Rather behind Ali, behind the Colorful yeah. Garage. Gonna exit on the Rockford Drive. So right, southbound, southbound, up, you turn. Going back to the alley, westbound. Parallel to Colorful Garage. Slowing down, right, northbound, uh, red, desert, up. Right, eastbound, Rockford Drive, left, northbound. No, this guy trying to juke. Second, eastbound, Rockford Drive, left, northbound, Sandra's Ave. Passing Decker Street, slowing down, right south, Banjita Street. Left, eastbound, alley, uh, parallel to Brown Garage. There's a block here. Might have uh, never mind, still going eastbound. On Cali's up, right south, Cali's, left, eastbound, Vespucci. Passing Red Garage. I heard a beep beep. Left, Hi. northbound, Alta Street. Right, eastbound, Sandra's F. Right, southbound, Park Street. Left, eastbound, Ali. Left, northbound, Sandra's, then 50 with the wall. Left, Sandra's, U turn, eastbound, Sandra's. Going back to the alley, 
Watch out. Uh, straight, straight. Ba Copy, slowing down, left. No, stick on you, southbound. Right, westbound, gonna end up on power. Uh, this guy's left. a fucking madman! <laughs> Just watch out, guys! Don't die! Right, or bottom of the street. Seconds. He's cutting through the fuck there. He's cutting through the promenade. Main vehicle. Heading towards uh, Peaceful Street. Northbound, Peaceful Street. Right on to San Andreas. Going upper. I'm falling back to tertiary, secondary college. Secondary comes. Um, um. Hello. Hello. Okay, primary taking comms, northbound with I'm street left, done. west by Havik Half. 1050, 1050 with some local car. I don't need to go eastbound. with you guys or anything like that, just uh, you're good. Just watch okay. out, guys, just Appreciate don't you. ramp you straight away. No problem. Appreciate you guys. Project is by Havik Half, right, southbound, edge enough. Passing pillbox. We gotta watch out, guys. Uh, I am so uh, sorry. Did he just kill that guy? That He's on San Andreas. Local. He 50 He 50 in an alleyway here. I got him. He's got a block set up with an orange car. Turn it on to Vespucci. Going southbound, Power Street. Right on to Adam's Apple. Going westbound. Uh, 250, I documented the car is being impounded. Do you need me on the pursuit? Um, let's stick on the car because that delay. was a boost car. They might try to go back and sneak get it. It's gonna be westbound, Lindsay Circus, passing the ammunition in the, in the uh, gas station. Right. It's gonna be going north here. Continuing on South Rockford, northbound. To me, Decca Street northbound. I need backup. I'm the only units on this eight. I'm going with you guys, by the way. So it's right all behind. Okay. Approaching Life Invader now. Right hand turn. Right hand turn. Hard right. Opposing lanes to travel. Boulevard Del Perro going eastbound. Fred, stop screaming. Sorry, I'm not proud. Yeah. My car cannot keep up with this on the street. His car. I right, continue in huh? eastbound. Speed 160 plus. Vehicle 50, we have a hard 50 here, I'm still on Copy. it. Northbound, vehicle is smoking at, at an alleyway. Two of them, they're getting out on foot. Both individuals oh. out on foot. I do. The one ran through the alleyway, the other one ran into the housing area. Copy, I'm taking this other alleyway. Watch out for an orange car, they had an I orange I just killed a guy car. with my tape. He pushed me over! What? The other guy's here on me! He's running to the west! He's running to the west! He just said on me. I got him, I got him! Hey! He's doubling back, he's doubling back. He's running back out west! He doubled back to double back! He's on the I've phone! Got him, I've got him, he's, he's on the Guna southbound. place. Southbound. It's on the phone, he's running south. Tell the tuber stay mobile just in case, man. Uh, heading east out of Howick. Uh, we're still uh, eastbound Howick. 272, I'm staying mobile just in case for a pickup. Uh, still running southbound. The Sagunas now. I've oh, got him. He's jumping up. Hey, 95. Stop it! Oh, close one. All right, he's gonna be going on uh, occupation. On foot. You got this. You got this, guys. Got him, y'all. Come on, you got he, him. He just, he has a gun, he has a gun! He's shooting! 78. They're gonna get just one guy. He's down, he's down, he's down. He's down, he's down. There he goes, he called it. Clear, clear oh. 77, clear it down to 77s, please. 
two four five. Over. See what you need me. Black car on the scene. Watch out. Maybe bolt. Tell the car to get away. Tell all those cars to get away. Yeah, we're uh, suspect we was on the phone all visual? the time. Um, lost visual of him. Oh, what's the twenty? Get that gauntlet away, meters. somebody. Okay, let's set up a perimeter. I got one guy that's down too. I didn't shoot him though. I just. Where are you? Where are you? Can anybody see the suspect? I'm on in the, the parallel portal? street. No, There's no, a car circle in here. Uh, Copy, I'm gonna cover you. Falls for a tow chore. For the champagne. No. Uh, who was primary? You need to set up. Where is Tush? Where is uh, uh, triage? Triage in this. Well, there there is no. Uh, well. Okay, so we're going to take this one. No, nine. I can step in if you need me. So. Well, uh, we're we going to move have our this 95. one back up to him. Move this secondary one that we just shot back up. That there's there's but, nobody here. We we don't know where he went. He's we shot him. He collapsed and he kind of just. Uh, have a look on the roof, try anything, look everywhere. Uh, even call out, he may have, you know, accidentally fallen into a crack. Um. Hey, good news, I got my 95 though. Hey, John. Uh, this match, uh, who, what are the outstanding, what are the descriptions for any interference vehicles or anything like that? It was an orange, not sure maker model, but there was an orange car. Okay, understood. It's King, I just rem I just reminded us like, what the hell is he doing? I, I, I gotta check the right canals. now. I just remember that he's doing a subathon. Can I last? I'm going to the canals. Maybe he fell to the canals. Oh, so hold. Oh, I don't know. Oh, the tunnels? Oh. Yeah, let's yeah. the clouds. Tunnels. There's a big car there in the alley, by the way. Just saying. Okay, it's so like 170 ish. But it's because. Uh, um... Above where he shot the guy down. Oh, he's waking up, he's waking up, he's waking up. The oh, acceleration uh, seems to be crazy. Like a bug then. Plus 195. Ooh, I haven't heard this music in a bed. Good shit. Yeah. BMS. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna cough it nice. Nice. Actually, three on channel two. Did I stay with the pink car and get it photographed? I, I was with the, uh, I pursued a 95 on foot. I was alone. I didn't document the pink car. Is anyone able to go back and document the pink vehicle? Uh, I'll, uh, 272, I'll go back. Uh, where was well, it? Well, hold on, time out. Here, 10 3, don't go alone. I take a partner with you, please. It could I, be I'm uh, gonna armed cover him. gunman out there. 475, he's going to cover him. Right, first. EMS, could we get you on Occupation Avenue near Rockford Plaza? Yeah, let's go. Thank you. Thank you. 250 is back on the original scene. Um, uh, the vehicle has been impounded. I went all the way to Grove Seedwood impound to get it impounded. I did create a report for it. I didn't know who was primary on scene, so feel free to promote my report to an incident.
Oh my god, Shad, I have something to tell you. Something that happened the other day. Mika, my cat, stayed outside during the night. <laughs> he always asks to come inside. But I guess he didn't that night. I didn't notice. And I didn't notice. And I went, didn't went looking for him. I thought he was inside of the house. <sighs> so, um... Yeah. Yeah, let me close these evidence pictures. Uh, vehicles processed, uh, nothing in the vehicle. Did he meet a cat, maybe? The with the he didn't card. when left my backyard. Uh, it was abused. Uh, okay, copy that. It was a boosted van with interference gauntlets. Funnily enough, they didn't come to help after the boost went off. Like all the interference vehicles disappeared, and this guy just started shooting. <laughs> Uh, RO for this pink premiere is going to be a Amara Bella Vow or something like that. But yeah. In the morning when my husband brought him inside, right? I believe he literally it's a personally slept the whole owned morning. vehicle, so it will have to be vaffed. Chubby. You. I did felt super bad, Sean. This is not a good call. This is not an organized, well communicated call, Sean. But I wasn't a call way too late. I don't even know where he is right now. He asked my husband. And funny enough, he sleeps not, not always. He also sleeps in the bed, but he's been sleeping inside on Maya's bed. <laughs> Been sleeping in Maya's bed. Two seven two. The VAV history on the uh, MDT is not working currently. Um, I'll take a look at it with you at the process processing cells after, okay? Um, EMS has got one that has to go to the hospital. Uh, I gotta get back to my car. Can someone follow through CMC? Uh, I can follow to CMC if you help. Um. Charlie 23 is ready to roll out. 95 doesn't need medical.
pull out. Shot 2376 team, C147. Oh god! Yeah. Okay. Jack, are you guys good up there at the pink car? Yeah, we're good. We just have a problem yeah, with the VAF report. Yeah, yeah, we're good, but the VAF report's not loading. It wasn't loading for me Two earlier one. either. I'm coming up. Copy. Class 76 to MRPD. Enjoy the way PD is hiding. I don't know. I want to see things settled. Uh, 272, do we have anybody in custody, uh, first name Amara? I, I, I literally want to see. I that think so. The passenger in the original police van. Cannot confirm though. Do we have the uh, arresting officers for both 95s present at CMC? Hey. Get out of here. Um, one of them did need medical. They just needed are to patch up, so they're already at the RPD. Yeah. Yeah. We've got 195. Uh, this could be at the hospital. Is somebody there? Yep. Uh, yeah, I affirm. It's There's a female uh, that has a similar color of that I think somewhat the, the passenger on the truck, by the way. And there's a white big arrow in the front of the hospital. So units inside, pay attention. He's literally just running around the street. And now she's going to the front. And she's by the white Perfect. arrow. Uh, this is 656. The female up front that was identified uh, has similar... Uh, has a similar description as the one from the uh, original passenger. Unless someone can 100% positively ID her, um, but keep an eye out, uh, but wouldn't, look, wouldn't go for her right now. Let's focus on what we have. Individuals going to the regular room. Or individuals going to the regular yard room. Both, both, uh, both side door rooms are locked. This is 609. Do we have an incident report set up for the latest arrest? Um, I think there was a... We, we need to escalate it. I'll do that now. Yeah. Alright, perfect. Mm -hmm. Move to incident. What's the status inside of the hospital? Um, I'm I'm in the side room with the 95. Better union? Oh. Uh, I'm I'm 
this room for now. I, I can't leave right now. Yeah, if, no, I'm just saying the other unit because we have two units. So I just want to make sure you guys are okay. Yeah, I, I have. We haven't heard from the other the other union yet. Ma, are you good? Uh, hey, firm. feeling oh. what about that evil why don't you just invest I better press with my Jimbo as a marshal. Smitty! Yeah. How you been? I miss you. Bro, there's boost back, man. And guess who's hacking boost already? I am. Oh, now oh we're my god. The fuck on. Now I'm about to fucking crash out on her. I'm fucking out now. Alright, 272, we're in round of MRPD with that Pink Premier. Right Maybe here. shopping every week and got you stressing them. Hey guys. Hey guys. Bye guys. No, fuck you. We are good to collapse channel two. Thank you everybody. When is it born? When is it? It's born. Or has it been born yet? My God, you're such an adult and responsible man. Crackhead, Craig, a father, guys. That's crazy. Eight weeks left to go down. That's getting close. That's what's up. <laughs> Out. Oh yeah, it's moonshine stake out or something. Where are they? Oh, 
Hopefully the Oh nice. Just the last things, yeah. Plus, there's never going to be enough. I remember when my sister was born, right? And my dad was literally like... She was born... And he literally went to buy more groceries. All the baby stuff, yeah. I mean, listen. I remember when my sister was born... Because, I mean, my sister... She was born when I was 17, so I know a lot of shit, right? I remember a lot of shit. And there was like the whole thing. There was like this whole thing of like really good like fucking diapers to avoid rash and blah blah. blah. And after like two weeks, they just started buying the cheapest fucking diapers because they they go through diapers like fucking. Kenny, Jesus was born in seventeen nineties. Y'all good here? Yeah, uh, I think the tow driver's oh, oh, there he is. Oh, okay, all right. We're okay. pretty. Wait, was that it? No one about somebody in Rob Dink, uh, Dink Sandy up in uh, Richmond area. I would area rather. Flash 245, I'm looking for the uh, C class that just went off around Power Street. Are there any 77s for that? 250. Um, we're, I think we have two or three attached to this, uh, these robberies. Uh, for Sandy. This guy's been, this is like his third one, King. So, uh, oh, shit. Do you need me? Yeah, I'm uh, through with this robbery up uh, environment. We got to look for these uh, individuals in a black color X. I said no, we're in purple. Okay, copy that. Uh, anyone from EMS, can I get someone to come and bump my ambo? I'm on its side. A location? Uh, on the trail up to the dam at Mirror Park. Two from my case. Got it. Okay, appreciate Sorry. you. Oh, go, go. Uh, Dan, what guidance do we have more? Is just a sentinel and what they were wearing? Sorry. Uh, there's a sentinel and, uh, uh, purple, purple attire. Okay, fair. There's ballers. I normally go up the too much. That's where they normally hang out at. So, Great Ocean might be a might want to put Great Ocean in the scope also. Two four five is back available. EMS has been saved. Where do you want me, Denzel? Fine with area from that last, uh, the latest nine one one. I'm picking up Justice uh, Director Angel right now at uh, MRPD. Stand by. Copy that. Do a vehicle description for what they're in. Is it a black and color Sentinel again? Hey, Ned. Uh, yeah, uh, black and color Sentinel. Right, I'm not sure if it was stopped up or not. I got, I got a. Oh. I contacted a three one one individual, oh, but uh, you, I didn't contact I'm, a nine one one individual. I, Break yeah. In the middle of it into Do you know why I saw you and I thought you were a little bit like further away, so I stopped to let you pass, and then uh, I stopped right in your line of. Uh... The black sentinel you were looking for. Mm. I'm yeah, sorry. I am sorry. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm. I'm fine. Driving on the wrong side of the road too. Jeez. What? I Jeez. mean, I was making the turn and then you bumped me, which pushed me to this side. I was, I was going. Yeah. I was coming here, you know, like Man. making a turn. You know, you you know you were speeding, right? I wasn't speeding. You were speeding. You know you were speeding. No, right? I wasn't. You it you was, were speeding. It was, okay. What was this? What's the speed uh, limit on this road again? It's forty, right? Right. It was forty, right? That was only going forty. Uh, what? Isn't it fifty-five? It is fifty-five. Yes. Oh, I thought it was forty. Well, I said that says something. I was only going like forty. Uh -huh. like... Okay. Uh huh. Well, we should move out of the middle of the road anyway. Yeah, that would yeah. be a good idea. Yeah. Okay. You guys, you guys stay safe, okay? Okay. You, you should. Too. You should go find a door. Awesome. Dispatch two twenty. Yeah. Show channel three collapse. UTL, but we got the car. Ten eight. Um, Copy that. Yeah. I... 
Waking up, that is crazy, man. 302, That is crazy. Waking up at noon, it's crazy. 302, 76. Yeah. Traffic, I'll go change vehicle first. Extra 4's got to uh, collapse onto that amazing. Yeah. 250 same traffic, 2 blocks away. 255, I was around the corner, we're pulling into the back alley now. The green color sentinel leaving at the back. Direction? Uh, it's just got onto San Andreas now, it's facing eastbound. I'm not sure if it's involved in parking from a burger shop. Keeping an eye on the bank itself. It's the, it's the car parked behind this uh, red the, one. The, uh, I just seen a bank drive out the uh, the, the back gate. Uh, call uh, Black Tailgate. So. Right there, that one came out the yeah. the, the, the actual gate. Eastbound on San Andreas Avenue. That one left the actual bank. Okay, there's a pink car that just left the front also. Lady on the radio, they just left. I'm, I'm just going to stay in the front covering. We've got the pink and the black car at the corner of North Rockford and San Andreas. I'm going to call you want to collapse on that tailgater? Yeah, two vehicles that... Uh... You both left the back of the bank, right? Hey, firm. Let's uh, let's get their number plates, fellas. There's, okay, so pink and colored Lampadati and a black and colored tailgater. They're on the intersection of South Rockford and San Andreas. Uh, I'll say we'd stick on the black one if we don't have the units to split between two of them. All right, I need one unit at least to help me clean the bank. I don't want to go inside. Yeah, I'm, I'm on my way. Okay. The we pink Lampadati. Was Gone. in the Sorry. front. I, I was in the front. I didn't saw them come from any gates. I would recommend you go to the tailgate. Uh, if I'm, I don't think this uh, Lampadai is involved. The do you have anyone which? Okay, this third unit, this LSPD unit. I need you to Everyone go to the. Everyone is uh, screaming. Oh, uh, what's the goal? I'm trying to get this. Can you get this pink Lampadai to fucking leave this? You guys need seventy seven. They've need just swapped okay, vehicles. Got, They've swapped vehicles. They've put stuff in glove boxes. I've watched them. Oh my god. I'm at the back. Okay. Cross go, let's clear this. LSPD, if there's anybody here, make yourself known. LSPD, no if there is here. nobody. If there's anybody here, make yourself known. LSPD. LSPD, okay, if there's anybody the here, make yourself We're known. Not going to do that. Of the units to split between the two. We've got the tailgater, we've got the three individuals that are out of it. They're talking with uh, Kate. Hello, see if there's the anybody here. The back door is all locked, the back garage door. Oh, shit. Oh, Hi. We're good. Did you clear up top and uh, downstairs? Nope, I just first floor now. Downstairs first? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. These are the LSPD. LSPD, anybody here make yourself so known? Dude. Nothing's opened. I get Everything's another okay. unit to get on foot with Cade. Uh, they're outnumbered at the moment, three to two. Or seven five twenty three. You know these guys are getting is felony trespassing. They came out of the back of the bank. Two twenty. Bank yeah, is clear. Fine. Nothing is opened. Okay. Where do you need can me you, at can first? You, can you come uh, at the back, please, with me, if possible, real quick? I have this uh, illegally parked vehicle here that I want to document. So okay. I just want to see you to stay close to me. Uh, I do not. PD from EMS. Send it. Uh, just leaving the bottom of Mirror Park Dam with a very critical patient. The 911 that came people said that someone was pushed. Uh, we may need to get you up there to look for something if anything has gone bad up there. Okay, very cool, quick. Okay, is this guy just not uh, I... cooperating or what? Uh, stand by. That's Suarez's van. If we got another doubled up unit, uh, can I get them out on foot? Just get these guys attained. If we're gonna walk these, around, these guys, these, these guys don't have a, uh, these guys don't have any money or anything other than. What's their explanation for being in the locked part of the bank? 
across the wood on As he doesn't have anything, they call us empty. There's nothing on their possessions that uh, indicate that they have taken anything from the bank. Right, but they came out of the back of the bank, which is normally locked. I mean, um, it could have been a situation where the gate was open as they drove, but it looked like they drove out of it. You know what I mean? I don't know how to word it. If you want to pursue it, we can. It's up to you, then we couldn't. Uh, it, it just... No, it's fine. Just leave it then. They're It's because... Yeah. It's, it look, okay. When they drove like past it, or they drove out of it, the gate door was open, and they were saying that they didn't drive out, and they drove around the side. But they have nothing yeah. on them, so I don't know. Do you have an Alex Torres on scene? All of them have been released. Yeah, they are. They, they are. I don't know. It's fine. There's nothing in this. Okay. What for parking violation? Uh, I mean, yeah. Triple four is breaking off. Three, two, same. That's low key. And he's all riding oh, with all. This is CLSPD. I need a I need a tow, please, for this van. It's illegally parked behind a maze bank. Thank you. I'm here. No. Alright, we're clear at the bank. Hey guys. Loki, why do you hate me? What do you mean? Why do you hate me? Every day it's always the same thing with you. What do you mean? I, I'm just tired of this aggressiveness towards me, Loki. What, what? what is wrong? What aggressiveness? Why I never do you even hate me? You, Hello. you yeah. can't do exactly. this. Exactly. I got enough going on. Anita, you can't do this to me right now. Wait, what do you mean you have you? enough going on? Okay, I Sorry. Did, did you call like M Frost or were you, you talking to me on radio? I was going to check the sewer entrance oh, of the I'm sorry. Uh, bank. When you said Frost on radio earlier, where do you need me, Frost? Were you talking to no, me or No, where, where you need me and Frost. I was only asking oh them where they needed God, us. Oh my God, that's not what I heard. <laughs> Sorry. My bad. Because I was like, yours. wait, that's not Frost. That's like a... <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah. Sorry, I'm just messing with Loki right now. Because he hates me. I don't hate me. you, Anita. You know... You know, he hates me too. Tell me. Shut, Shut up, Frost. Oh, Shut up. Oh my God. Yeah. Tell me yesterday... I hate you, Frost. It's like that. literally not true. But wait, 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 you're telling me what you got going on? What the heck? A lot of shit. Like what? Like what? Hey, you're a. Hey, do you wanna? You wanna do? Is Den still around? I don't know. Maybe. Wait, is hey? You look at my senior report about him. You wanna talk to him about it? Not my. It's, it's not. He's shift one. Triple four and Rod said I let us I did all the other three on it. There's no two. senior from shift one. Uh, whoever him, that is that queued up uh, first on the radio, I did not hear you at all. You're really low. We have what one senior. What the heck? Senior. Maxwell didn't do anything. Me, I didn't talk uh, loud enough. I'm 76. What is it? Yeah, oh, the thing. Oh, the complaint with. The three of us, we need one more, right? I thought that someone like got a six. Or was it six? I went and talked to the lifer in person, I'm and then four, uh, I took the statement awesome. from Croc on her behalf. Uh, so it sounds like a situation a where somebody, I'm guessing, the, grabbed Den when they were going up to prison. Situation. And he uh, ended up going up to prison, and offense. then he ran out, which is fine. But then they asked him if he could Isn't unlock it? the showers, and he basically just taunted them, talked a lot of shit to them, and left and didn't help them out. Uh, we'll probably need a 77, yeah. Try to you come into this? Hey, firm. Uh, in my opinion, if the there is going to have the showers oh, oh. open, you can, on, at the very like, minimum, more wait for more officers vehicle, yeah? to come with you and go but in and unlock it for them, especially if they're being compliant. I don't really... Do you still need... There's no reason to be a dick for no reason. I'm gonna need it for a store robbery. Is it four or is it like six? If it's four, we have four. We, we don't need... We don't need... It, listen, SOP say six. We don't need six. We could do it with four. Uh, we do four. This is enough for the uh, store robbery, please. And this did happen uh, like a month ago or whatever, but also Seems to the be lifers maybe don't. Three suspects I gave her my number and said if she has though. an issue or lifers do, they can contact me. But before, they didn't really know what to do or how to contact uh, this person, you get a turn up with this She's doing all right. Yeah. Doing okay. Yeah. How are you doing? How's um, everything? Oh, pretty shitty, but that's okay. Uh, just so you know, uh, we have worked out that our pay was uh, decreased 
Um, uh, channel one for the store robbery, guys. Channel one for the store robbery. Uh, cadets and PPOs and are finding it very picture? hard to do a four to five hour shift, what, just so channel? that you know. By the time you buy food, well, by the time you get same. your car. Nice. Uh, I think it's between, I want to say around 8.59. Uh, sorry, channel two for the store robbery, channel two. Holy shit. And so I just want to let you know that um, it's really hard for cadets and PPOs right now to repair the car at the end of the shift, to get mm. fuel, uh, to get food, to last them through. Um, yeah, I've been and I willing to pitch some money. I, I know a lot of people are going to say, well, you guys have been on max two. pay, and, but there's only... That's not <laughs> that's some PPOs. Then. Yeah, it's so, I mean, I, I bought some meals last week, uh, you know, so that's yeah. what we're... Uh, God forbid the police make money for once in our lives, by the way. Well, it's it's not that. It's just that you I thought we had established transparency and that someone would tell us. And then uh... last... I think it was it was two nights ago that... Me, it was two nights ago a PPO said, Oh, yeah, it was a cadet said, Can you please Go fill up PD. the car? I've got no money left. I said, what the do you mean? That I just and they said, well, the I, I away. don't Can have any money. Hey, no, Julian. You're good, you're good. Yeah, you're fine. Or is you found Thank out. you, Julian. Yep. Um, yeah, I... So i just just letting you guys yeah. know to spread the word that we may have to help people out. I'd be willing to pitch like 20, 30k. Uh, yeah, just uh, just just by you know, if you see a PPO uh, or somebody, just throw them throw them a bit of money. Or Do you something. know how the funding's working? Like, I know we like there was a change with how like, the, two, the budget. Yes, the goes. counties. Yep. Uh, can we? Is there any way we can use that? Like, who has access to that? I guess is it just the chief, or is it like? Uh, just the chief. Yeah. Okay, so I mean, maybe depending on how much money's in there. Some of that can go towards their repairs or whatever. Well, Duncan has been paying for repairs out of his own pocket. He literally has been repairing CVPIs and Tauruses, bless his heart. Yeah. Um, he out of his own pocket. Refunds. Yeah, so he will have to ask for that from the new chief. I'm mm. just saying that if you see a see a cadet, you know, buy buy them lunch. Have a two rival, you sheep. know what I mean? Just uh, and hopefully uh, someone will tell the chief that uh, we're not getting uh, a good enough paycheck right now, and that's why a lot of people are finding it difficult. Uh, chief, uh, the newer the codes. Side, you follow me there. All right. All right. I'll I'll let you guys go. Okay. Right. It's just a parking violation. It's not involved to the incident, so we're fine. I feel like you're gonna do the same as me. I'm curious. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I believe you hate is, me. Is Ruby a senior now? Yeah, so I actually oh. I went to talk to the chief and she told me that she hasn't he's gonna be doing interviews for us, Chief, and shut the Ruby wasn't a senior now. Oh. Need to lock my car real quick. Yeah. Damn, I just got 103k. Wow. Maybe hmm. I should buy a second vodka. You have a vodka? Yeah. Oh I want to put a light bar Why? on it. Because it's funny. Oh, I never drive car. it. It's in the. You never uh, drive in? It's in the PD parking lot. I told people if they need to use it for UC, they can. Thank God. Please, God. Why can't I. I mean... <sighs> let me, oh, let me, let me mess with Plotted. You see? 65610 There. Pot had told me he was gonna play as Noodle. I'm bored. 
And I'm gonna code six with those gunshots where I'm not gonna move in or anything. Seven, same traffic. Do you have any other units responding to the 71 calls by popular uh, hunting processing area? 255. Is this about the shots fired on Vespucci? A firm. Yeah, uh, it, that could be a sunny robbery. No. Cool. Looks like there's a black SUV and a black four door. Uh, 22, the black SUV. Uh, there's a black four door parked on Vespucci coming up over the bridge facing westbound. I don't westbound. think I'm going to switch though. I think the units called out uh, heading to it. Do you have any more 77s? Uh, north on Poplar. I'm going to keep a wide uh, berth there, but let's going to look into the alleyway. Okay. Uh, there's... Okay, someone with a tiny vest just put something in their back pocket. There's two people down towards the back of the truck. They're moving them now. We need units to... If we got units, we need them Could to Could be units here. There's a white shirt running out, probably to tell us what happened. 42076. You see a sanitation truck? There's uh, about two people injured, two people bandaging. 250 is 23 Popular Street. We'll see if we can get more info about what happened. There's a, a um, dark gray in color four door like Masakro kind of lurking. I last saw him go down the ramp, like underneath the Vespucci bridge. Uh, can I get, um, just, we don't know what happened, but we do have the bottles here. Uh, just get those three people who are up, just put them in cuffs, have them detained just for a moment. Oh, Keep the, yeah, and keep the down suspects and those two separate, uh, but outside of your shot with each other. Get 77. Um, considering... Hey there, me, ma'am. I'm yeah, gonna put you in cuffs, okay? okay. Scene security. Okay. Scene security. Are you bleeding okay. or anything, man? Oh, oh, wait, okay, uh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, 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 you're fine, you're fine. We can right. downgrade it, but just for right now. I'm just gonna hang oh, up the, uh, yeah, canal? Put some on uh, it's by the processing for the bleeding. hunting pelts and okay. meat. And, Are you bleeding or, meat, or anything the, like that that I should know of? Um, oh, uh, we have a man over here that's saying he's bleeding. We need 52s. Oh, okay. Which 20? We're gonna be over here by okay. the uh, Darnell Bros building right off of the Vespucci Bridge. Okay. Uh, we're just gonna yeah, switch yeah, you, you to guys a little bit here. while uh, we're getting you guys medical too. Is anybody medically trained okay. and can uh, start for this, putting uh, pressure on this man's hey, gunshot sir. wounds? Wow, what's the 20 again? I'm fine with that. It's gonna be the Darnell, uh, Darnell Bros building here off of Popular Street in the Vespucci Bridge. We got a lot of units on scene. Okay, well, um, I just wanna update you what's gonna uh, happen, okay? Uh, mm -hmm. First of all, my name is uh, uh, I'm last Sergeant Nita May, found in the LSPD, canals, but I don't have sight of it and now. we okay, just want to grab so everybody's statements. We want to know what happened. Black vehicle okay? was called there as a, uh, um, being a part of this and robbing. So once you guys get uh, medical and everything is okay, all right, we're gonna go and do that. All right. Okay. Um, if at any time you feel like you're gonna pass out or you are actively bleeding, please tell me, okay? Oh, yeah, yes, ma'am. 47 sure was get, shot. Um, I think these 47s were shot if you can get to, okay? some okay. evidence as well. Okay. 710. Is it busy for you today? Uh, yeah, make sure everyone, um, uh, make sure the three, uh, super crazy, three but individuals busy, in the ball is back to their, uh, cops. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Uh, question. Do you have a weapon, a firearm, or anything like that? They're all cops. Yes, like, do you yes, shoot, have you shot it? Yes, um, I have mine, and I think I shot it once. I don't think I hit anybody, though, but then okay. I also took the one off the one guy on the ground. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, I'm gonna search, I'm gonna just, uh, approach for those guns, so I just want to take them for our safety, okay? Uh-huh. Gonna frisk you before anything. Oh. Okay. Okay, 
I'm gonna just reach for those weapons right now, okay? Yes, ma'am. Do our gun. Uh, is the uh, sanitation robbery still on this channel? Okay. Yes, it is. Uh, do you want to get it moved to another channel so we're not clogging main, main free? Yeah. Uh, do you have dispatch? Or... Is there a free channel we can move to? Dispatch, you copy? Uh, I only reach for the weapons, nothing more, okay? Okay. Gonna GSR test. Yeah. Radar check. Oh, wow. Ben two. Ben two. Ben two. Yeah, what's up? Uh, unless I miss anything, radio or sorry, clean up for the Zubo Cowboys. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. I'll double check. Okay. The 2076 strawberry gas. My radio. Uh, like a filing cabinet thing? Yeah. That might have been what they were trying to get, maybe, because it's just on the ground here instead of in the back of the truck. Yeah, I those are. I believe they get that from picking up the trash, I believe. Yeah, the, those are recyclable materials from the porch cans. Yeah, yeah, so I'm I'm think I'm wondering if this is what they were trying to rob them of, because it's kind of weird that they're here and they're not stored in the truck. Oh, nice. Yeah, typically these would be stored in the truck and taken back to the sandy yard. Yeah, if, um... Very yeah, I'll give it a minute. I'll just, um, I'll let the three officers just get corporate statements to them. But there is a 911. I have it documented now of three individuals wearing ballers, uh, flags, uh, robbing sandy workers. Yeah. So. Be before we get any, like, my, 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 my per person that I have detained, she, uh, she, she needs medical. I have them. Yeah, I know we already called for EMS, but we might have to call them again. So EMS no, are here, they're, they're, they're treating the incapacity people at the moment. Oh, okay, so if, okay, my if bad. your 95 needs medical, maybe bring them to the front to get that done. Be mindful of these people. Uh, I'd uh, probably just keep them separated. Once, yeah. If we can keep these, if we get these guys stable, then the EMS will yeah, come EMS down. EMS is around uh, here. Just... Aid, uh, could just look uh, over the... Uh, okay. Could tend no, to that uh, person as well. So uh, I'm here, so you... Yeah. Uh, what's statement, your name? Yeah, oh, my name is right Jason Todd. Oh, okay, Miss Jason. Um, are you Don't feeling you okay? A, uh, Did you just tell me what happened, or? I'll pull up now. Uh, Would you yeah, get uh, uh, first? I'm... No, I, I'm okay. I think okay. they did shoot me a couple times, but I'm not bleeding. Okay, okay, okay. We'll get you medical anyway. But if you want to give me your statement, okay. I'll be. Yeah, I don't need that. Okay. Um. So, we were doing Sani. It was actually my first job. I, I just. I just joined the group. Uh, yeah, and, you're gonna have to tell uh, what's going we, on with these we items. Were here, um, and I got like I don't a really want to just pick them up and take them in case they are actually the, there, because the, they could the just drum. have them back, right? And then I just started carrying QQs, and I I tried to run and hide, but they they were kind of chasing me. So that's when I um I pulled out my my gun and I I shot it, but I don't right, the, know the if it that. actually hit them or not. Hey, McQuillan, uh, myself. Oh, actually, never mind. Okay. Um, any, what happened after that? Um, after that, um, uh, I looked in his pockets and I. Get I that exported to uh, incident. The, I think he had pink hair, maybe pink purpley hair. Um, can I get a consensus of what uh, the statements are looking like between... I already got one from the guy oh, in all oh, black. Oh, and then um, we, we started the hearing the wee-woos for the, 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 the cars, and that's when I ran to the street and... Um, the 47 um, we have, or uh, was you have to be one of you down and then was told to stay next uh, to the truck. Our LGS so are I positive. I fell for my uh, first weapon. No gun there. Okay, all right. All right, give me a second. Okay, alright, so the statement that I have from one of the females from the sanitation truck. Um, they're doing Senny. Um, she, they, they, she, they started hearing shots. She tried to run and hide. Uh, she, they chased her, she shot. Um, 
And then she tried to take her gun and open fire at them. She doesn't know if they hit them. But then she looked into the, a guy's pockets with pink and purple hair and took a firearm. She, this is a female with black hair, white shirt, black pants. She robbed the guy. Yes. This is a makeshift uh, gun. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. That makes things do, do, do the guys, like all of them in the ground, not have firearms? One of the crystals doesn't. Or is it just crystals? I got you. Who has. Uh, do you have officers assigned to the 47s that are down? Yeah, they, they do. They all have someone. I'll just go okay, over and be loud over there. Okay, um, I need you guys to listen to the radio real quick. Um, I know, Crystal, you said yours doesn't have a firearm. What about the other two? Do the other two have firearms or no? Oh, mine did not have a firearm, but he had some makeshift parts. Okay. A GSR positive most likely robbed off their guns. They can easily articulate, like... Okay, all of them don't have firearms. The, like... Hey, McClellan, uh, are we oh, good to uncuff this guy in black and just get his uh, and phone number? Do you want us to wait? It is. Uh, I, want, I want you to wait until we're... Right. Um, securing... It. Okay, so the... All the ballers, guys, they're going to be 95s. Um... Anita, I'm inclined. Oh, you're right here. I'm inclined to say. Uh, what, what do you think about your one? Before I say anything. Um, the here's the thing. I 100% believe that they were being robbed, ambulance but ambulance. if you're gonna have in possession. Uh, they all done everything. The firearm, you just Eight robbed from. Like, okay. the yeah. thing is, they didn't try to run. She even said that she was. She, when she heard the siren, she tried to get an officer into the scene. Yeah. Did she do that? She ran over. She ran over to me. Okay. Um, but I think that's because there was. So I wasn't the first. She has a weapons scene. license. She has a completely. She has no criminal uh, history. She doesn't even have a ticket for speeding. Did we already check the trash truck? I can leave that up to you. What do you think? Because I, it's, it's a, it's a difficult one, right? Because what are the other guys? Are the, the others you guys have ready? Friends? Like the thing. No, none of them have guns. One of them has makeshift parts. Six, five, six, three, no, yeah, no, means. I see her friends, the sanitation guys. Her friends. Uh, the guy in all black does not. The, uh, I don't know about uh, Pierce. Okay. okay. Are we gonna repeat that? Who's primary? More or less I'm calling. I'm calling. Yeah, yeah, I'm calling. Okay. Where would you like two people to just roll out? Yeah, if you've got enough people to go with you, all the processing officers plus uh, Mar, I think you were going to assist with the uh, transport as well, weren't you? Yeah, for him. Yeah, yeah, just uh, let me know. Okay. Okay. And, uh, uh, um, I'm good to give his gun back, all right? Yes, you are. Okay, cool. Um, okay, this guy in yeah. front of us has a uh, weapons license, his gun, nothing else on him. Guy in black, GSR negative. Involved, but like, you know, been shot at, ran away. Fine. Yeah. The only difference is your one who took the gun yeah. off. The thing is, like... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this gun has her cereal and everything. Like, I don't... Um, if you want to make the argument, uh, I, I, that, you know, if I was her, for her, own safety. for her own safety yeah, and protection, right? You never know. Mm -hmm. So, um, I can leave it up to your discretion. To I would, uh, no, I'm, I'm happy to seven? let her go okay. and okay. just give her a very firm link. Um, did we go on? Did we go on a I mean, nine one one this? Uh, we got a not from this one, but we did get a nine one one that the like. 
three ballers that were robbing. With the 347s we have. Yeah, um, uh, I'm gonna tell her next time um, instead of like going to someone's pockets the, to call 911. Uh, we would have yes. had enough time. Are they looking at anything yeah. uh, uh -huh. bad? Yep. Um, okay, so the other three. The other three. Charges will the 47s be looking at? Uh, stand by, I'm just getting that sorted out. Um, um, five feet, one. Sorry, what channel? Uh, three. Hospital's good for you, can bring them in. Did they end up stealing any materials? Did they have any materials or anything like that on them? Uh, I need to ask that. I don't think so. I don't... Oh, okay, let me see. The ball those ones. Um, Crystal and the, the other two officers who have the 47s or, or 95s, whatever they're going to be. Um, did they have any materials or anything on them? Did they have anything that they had stolen off them? Or is it just the fact that they had no weapons? Please listen to me on radio, please. Yeah, uh, I think someone has like a makeshift magazine, but other than that, uh, no, no firearms. What? Any sort of materials or anything that you know would be inherent of them robbing these three? My guess said my ninety-five does have some recyclable materials. Yes. There you go. Okay. We found the... like reports throughout the whole day of a black car with yeah. uh, people wearing purple. Yeah. Okay. So there's enough there to charge them. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what would it be? It'd be aggravated. Uh, robbery? Denzel has um. Uh, Denzel oh, right. has also more so, uh, like, context on more robberies throughout the day. It is pretty. It's pretty crazy, you know. Yeah. Today. They got. Robbed uh, and then shot. I have Den's fucking. Mm -hmm. I don't have Den's number. Got that one. Three and one for him. I know it's fucked up. These guys just ruined our night. Well, I guess theirs is going a little worse than ours. Because like they are literally oh, on the sanitation here, uh, truck. The sanitation truck is literally here. Gang, and you can't even this is a place where people collect trash. Like it's. You know. Yeah. Robbery gone wrong, real. Um, Crystal, they're more than likely going to get charged. Uh, I'm just figuring out what it is. If you, uh, so they are 95s for the moment. Okay, well, they're on. Uh, name, names on the report. Perfect. We have, uh, the, uh, the report, uh, promoted to an incident. Why do you hate me so much? No, you're the one that hates me. You hate me. No, you you hate me. I like I didn't do anything. And like you came around when I'm around, didn't even say anything, and it's I like I didn't even know you were I just woke like, up and then McCool and Espo wanted to ride with yeah, her. Yeah, and it's like, you know, whatever. I fucking hate Anita and I never want to say hi to her, so it's like whatever. Woke up to see the tea. I guess. There is a Look lot of tea. tea. There is so a much lot tea. of tea. There's yeah. so much tea. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. In the, in the yeah. But they, yeah, these three should be good to go. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, we're giving guns back, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If they have a legal firearm, give them back. And get his ID and phone situation, number. But, uh, uncuff him? Yeah, uncuff him. Okay. Get his uh, get phone number guys. and a picture of right. his ID. Um, Miss Jason, I'm gonna give you back mm -hmm. your weapon, okay? Oh, thank you. Here's, um, here's one thing, okay? Um, and uh -huh. I want you to understand this. Um, you have an illegal firearm on you right now. And you know why, right? Because you robbed that guy and you got the, the gun that he had, right? Um, oh, I, I understand, yeah. Yeah. So, um... I, 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 I understand that you wanted to remove a firearm for your own safety and so on. Um, but next time, I, I really need you to... Um, I really need you to call police. Uh, do a 911 yes, yeah. and so on. I understand. Um, I'm sorry. Yeah, especially you have a firearm. Your firearm is going to be linked to this report and everything. Um, mm -hmm. And, you know, it's within your 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 duty as a firearm holder to report crimes whenever, you know, they, they happen and you need to um, discharge your firearm, okay? You are being let go, okay? I am oh, giving you. you this um, out of free out-of-jail card, okay? Um, 
You have a clean think, record. You, you don't have anything. Uh, um, two five five crystal. Yeah, I, I was kind of panicked. I, I apologize. So I, I, I will do better next time. Firm? The first, pay, uh, yeah. first pay, uh, um, Honestly, um, we've heard okay. that there was a uh, lot of robberies sure going with sanitation and so on. Uh, we are aware um, this is happening yeah, today and 90 so on. Sure they're gonna uh, get, anything uh, suspicious, this, call so us right away, okay? Once they're you can bring them to MRPD yes, and uh, I'll you, be okay. there. Yeah. All right. Um, well, Dan is getting in contact um, with Roman Athos, who was also another person who got robbed. All of your friends are being let go. We took all of your guys' statements, okay? So, well, yeah. We take all of your statements, uh, and I... I do need your phone number just in case we have any follow-ups, oh. okay? Is oh, that okay? yeah, definitely. I'll, I'll slide you my card. Appreciate the cooperation, guys. Hey, yep, that'll be guys. very How good. How is that? Response. Yes, no, that's okay, perfect. great. Okay, all right. You stay safe, okay? Uh, again, Thank you guys... You. Listen, guys, you guys see any cars following you or anything like that? Any suspicious at all of, like, anything like that or, car, or even the cars that they had? Just 911 right away, okay? We're literally trying to off. tackle down these yeah, robberies that have been happening for a few hours. At, um, so the we're sunny truck we're on your side, you okay? Guys are all good to go. I mean, thank I you appreciate so much. the background. Oh, and, uh, and, and you guys what? really. Yeah, Sorry? That was a really, really good quick. response, to be honest. Yeah. That was. You it, were really quick. It wasn't a quick place from, you know, the city ish in a way that it did allow us to respond quite quickly. Okay. All right. Well, you guys have a good one. Okay, stay safe. I Appreciate have no it. idea where my Thank car you. is, so I'm gonna try to look for it. Yeah. All right. Ciao. Take care. All right. Appreciate bye bye. It. Okay. I think this is my car. Yes, it is. Uh, did you or turn up? Uh, Anita, do you have the um that makeshift pistol? Hey, firm, I do have it. It's my possession. I'm gonna. Is, there's a report already up, right? I'm gonna go to Mission Room. I'm gonna yes, input sir. this evidence, put my statement on it, and heard the lady's statement. Perfect, yeah. Uh, yeah, statements in as quickly as possible, and any evidence signed. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, hey, firm. I'm gonna do that right now. So I'm 10 safe draft. I'm gonna, I'm gonna park, I'm gonna, I'm gonna park outside, you're good. Hello. Hello. How you doing? I'm gonna make my report you? here. How are you? I'm gonna make my report here. Okay. I'm okay. Just actually patrolling. Wowie. I know, right? Oh my god. Actual patrol. That's crazy. You sure you don't need a passenger princess to mark all your calls down? Ah, honey, I've been looking at that cadet too <laughs> and just waiting for that freaking cadet to get out and ask if you want to ride with me. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, I know, right? That's Interval! crazy. I know, right? Way too late for me to take a cadet right now. Yeah, it is way too late for anything. Yeah, boom. It's the good chief. Nice. Uh, is anyone still on radio frequency or everyone go back? Fuck, I am, but I am. Hmm? Uh, I am. What's up? Um. Did any. Uh, I just want to know who collected evidence on the scene? Like uh, casings and so. Uh, it was so a BCSO officer. He had the. Uh, uh, this melon. Hat. Okay, there you go. Okay, that's right. Uh, yeah, I just want to make sure there's somebody, uh, somebody did.
How was your conversation with the chief? Because uh, the little bit that I heard was um, something. Uh, what? <laughs> What? It's, I listen. You guys were having a conversation <laughs> in the freaking hallway, okay? And I was yeah, we were passing uh, we through, had, okay? Listen, and, we had um two uh -huh. minutes of a conversation, and she was uh -huh. like, "Yeah, we'll we'll talk about this in a meeting." And I was like, "Sure, yeah, I love meetings. <laughs> Smile. I love, yeah, mm -hmm, fun. Um." I told her that because Jay uh, was the the um, that Are we she's considering quitting. Uh, so I told her that you know both yeah, me I tried to and Jay are we're considering on the last quitting because they're leaving because it's not great working here. Um, and she was like, "Oh, okay, yeah, we'll have a meeting about that," and you know the. Relationship with dispatch. I was like, well, it's more of like the relationship with PD that is struggling really badly, and that was it. That was all. Ma, we're coming like, out with the we'll pick this up again because she hadn't got a phone call. Hmm. Uh, 95 is out now. Yeah, it was kind of interesting. She was like, yeah, we'll have a meeting about this. Um, we'll pick up the talk later. And I was like, sure. But, Alas, I foresee that it's not going to happen. Hmm. Which was really weird. That's the 95 other the car is our car is gone. Just, just me out of like the dispatch room to be like yeah i want to talk to you and i was like why are you asking just me about how dispatch is i mean it's because she said who's the head of dispatch you like yeah but <laughs> still then she went on to ask me how like how dispatch is how everything is oh so this question she could have asked anyone mm. Interesting person. I also did bring up that I literally handed her an application last month. Yeah. Get loaded up and pick it up. I mean, she said she was part of the skeleton crew, but still. Never seen her ass. Yeah, exactly. Alright, all the 95s are loaded up. You ready to roll? It is euros in Portugal, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah, uh, Roman Atlas, Rob, was that a part of your situation? No. Huh. Yeah, I need to go to the evidence room, too. Okay. I'll go ask this guy what situation that was. Mm -hmm. Alan Shan. I don't know. I have a WhatsApp message for this annoying. Okay. You see? What time is it? Oh, it's Chat, I kind of want to go for the two and just go to a clothing store for like next hour and just get Anita a bunch of outfits.
<laughs> that would also require me to go off duty with Anita, which is a rare one. Okay, uh, with those 90s we have, uh, we have people here that said they were robbed earlier by them, so if we could put them in the lineup room and see if they can be positively identified, that would be good after they've been fingerprinted and their possessions have been seized. Uh, do you say we're going to put them through a lineup room? Yeah, we uh, don't say this on radio or anything, but we have people here who said they were robbed by them earlier, and we want to see if they can positively identify them. Do you want them all in there at once? Bro, are you just... Um, I'll leave that up to McQuillan. What is the freaking report of this involved? No, I was just... I'm just not married. There's an officer involved. Got it. Yeah, we'll, we'll just do all at once. Let us know when you have them do in there. Do you want them there now? Uh, yeah, let us know, uh, after you've seized their possessions and fingerprinted them and all that, um, let us know when you have them there, and we'll bring the people down to check. Yeah. Okay. MDT, frick off. Need one to eight. One of the 95s is requesting a lawyer. Oop. When the card is called the time, not a life, the heart to realize, just the death of peace of mind. Where am I in my locker? No, that's an evidence locker. Oh, hey, Beers. Hi. Uh, since Hi. one of the 95 is getting a lawyer, do you want it after they deal with the lawyer? An evidence beforehand? locker. Where is wife? That's a lot of points. Um, I think I'm gonna go 42, but I'm probably just gonna spend a bunch of hours in a clothing store. I oh. haven't got a new outfit oh, in ages. <laughs> and you know what? Ah! Huh. Kinda in the mood to do yeah, that Yeah, okay, today. so we're gonna so, put them in the lineup room. We're them. not questioning them right now or anything, Have so, you. uh... Matter though. Have fun with that. Sounds for yeah. so we can, uh, really give me the lineup room before you get to the lawyer, right? That paywall. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go there. You drip yes. suit TM. You should probably check it out. Okay, I will. You're beginning this month's drip soon. TM, <laughs> I can feel it. That's a lot of copium. Stop talking. <laughs> Any moment now. Wasn't it like... Two weeks ago that we got new clothes? So I don't yeah, it was really it. late last yeah. time. Yeah. Oh well. Okay, I am gonna get them to park the car and change. Okay. Don't question. I just got tackled by the female. You could get aggressive with her. Get her, Rasmin, try get her, ass! Hi. 
Oh, hey. 195. We'll stay back. Where's the second individual, or do we have another one? She's potato put a termite in there, Frost. probably. Yeah, that is we, actually We've got true. ours uh, just north of you guys. I just thought of where to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Elf, elf. Hey. Hello. You missed from Petey. Start a war. Standard. Can you? Uh, we have you staged uh, close to a uh, catfish V. Uh, close to Union Union Road, sorry. What's the status on the other lady? Yeah, we have a... Uh, she's in cops, it's a 95. Then for... <sighs> she wanted to be a cop again so bad, she just, she just had to apply, man. At Frost, do you need an additional unit with you, or... You only have two units there. Yeah, we're only two, if we can get one, please. Six five six can rotate over there. We Thank could also you. triage here if you guys want. Uh, EMS going uh, down the way. She's still around. them in. Wow, Daisy's around. Let's call her. Hey, Anita. Oh my god. Hi, Daisy. How you doing? I'm all right. What's up? Not much. I'm uh, I'm going off duty because I want to like, uh, just want to get some stuff and so on done. And I saw that you're around. I I needed to talk to Sherry, but I guess she not around anymore, right? I need I need a weapon. Yeah, person. I think she went to sleep. God damn it. Oh, uh, Angel's around. I don't know oh. if any other clerks are around. Oh, okay. Guess I'll just but call Angel. Angel uh, is also. She's staring bore holes into one of our rookies. Huh. Yeah, um, uh, w one of the... Oh, there's no clerks around. I think Angel is literally your only option. I think she's going to Mission Row, though. So you might be able to grab her there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna get that sorted. Yeah. Is, I think Sherry was around like most of the day and um, she just went to sleep. That's fair. Yeah. So, what are you doing off duty? I don't know. I, I haven't <laughs> I haven't picked new clothes in ages, Daisy, so I kind of <laughs> want to do that. You're uh, going to be at that clothing store for the next three hours. I'm not going to be in a clothing store for three You're gonna hours. You're going to be at that clothing store for three hours. <laughs> I'm not gonna be for uh, three hours. You're gonna be there for three hours. Okay, I know it. Oh my god. What do I need to answer for this weapons license thing? I don't even know. Um, like, stand your ground. What's the negligence stand your ground. Time, right? Yeah, the negligence of a class one. Uh, how many guns you can have. Stuff like that. Okay. Mm hmm. 
reported. Pretty simple. Like, you should know everything. Never know. Unless you're, like, Never forte. Know. Yeah, I heard. Uh, I heard. Yeah. Okay. How are you doing? Are you enjoying? Sherry's sure trying to poach me to the marshal's office. Yeah, why not? Come here. Why not? Yeah, just come here. Ah. <sighs> I'll be honest, we're so busy doing other shit that, like, I don't even miss patrolling. I don't know if it's just a me thing, because I kind of go around and do, like, whatever. Uh, but, yeah, I don't even miss patrolling hey, because Viv. I have so much shit to do. Hey. Oh, Viv's a room. Yeah. Went to the lockers. Yeah, I heard you guys got a new chief of police. We did. We did. I talked to her today. Yeah, Frost told me this morning, and he said it was Daisy, and I was like, "Huh? Did somebody make you looking good, man?" Outside, come on. Yeah, no, said it was somebody that I guess no one really knows. Hey, honey, do you want to come to the clothing store with me? You're gonna trap your wife in that clothing store for. I'm not gonna trap my wife. I'm not gonna trap her. Okay, Daisy is saying that I'm gonna trap you in the clothing store. Like she doesn't what? spend hours in the clothing store. She literally has a new outfit every five minutes. She's worse than me. Me or your wife? My wife. Nadia. Are you talking about clothes. me? Yeah, I'm talking about you. I'm saying it. Okay, you have a new true. outfit every mind. five minutes. Wow. She's not even denying it. She's not even denying it. You should break up with her. Daisy! What? I'm going to disregard what you just said. You I mean, sound like Peach right now. Good. What do you mean? You're. Oh my god, I swear to god. <sighs> I can't believe you say these, you're saying these things. Oh my vest! God damn it, I always forget to put my vest away. I always forget to put my vest away. It's all your fault, Daisy. Well, Daisy's just disconnected. Oh, she's probably. You might have had a headache, can... though. Oh, do you think we can borrow five million dollars from Daisy? It would be so nice if we could buy those <laughs> houses. Oh my god, that would be so good. I feel like it's gonna be horrible to decorate there. I feel like it's gonna be hell. I have a feeling that I don't have to worry about decorating the place, so I'm chilling. Okay, all right. I'm chilling, so... <clears throat> yeah, yeah, you, you know how I am with decorating. You know, I, I'll put a couple of things and so on, but you're you're the artistic one here. Spork, thanks for the read. What happened? Did you just crash? Hey, Nine. 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 Yeah, I guess I have a good point, actually. Yeah. You wanna go? Okay. 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 You have your car? Uh, I do have my car, yeah. Okay. Alright, I'll just go to the Night-night! Night! night. Yeah. We had two new applicants today. That's good. Bill Maze and uh, Pipsqueak. It's <clears throat> a problem. <laughs> you know, I see the potential on Pip. See, that's what I'm saying. Listen, I, know, I, see, right? I, see, right? I see the potential on Pip. And listen, I see a moral boost. Maybe. But maybe. Is he? Uh, wait, I actually, I think it's a she, right? It's a she, that. yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. So, okay, so, you know what? Has she tried to kill several? Maybe, okay? 
maybe, but, it's but she's fine. not we'll Bill Mays, so happen. I mean. Listen, we'll, we'll do like how they do in prison, right? Put shackles on her, then she can't hurt you, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's a good idea. That way, she can be employed and not hurt people. So that that that's how it works, right? You know the funniest thing that happened today? What happened? The angel told me that I would have made a great a good chief. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna disagree, you probably would. I would probably go mad. Yeah, you'd I would probably actually lose probably mind, go mad. Yeah. You'd also probably do good. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Honey, you have IFX in your little box. So unless you wanna we can just use them <laughs> or I don't know. Where is he? Malik, I don't know. Use them, just give me one, I'll use it. Here, use all three of them. Smile. Wow. Yeah, sure, I'll just... Yep, there I go. Listen, you'll probably need it. Oh, okay. Alright. Because yeah, I'm a passenger, got it. Okay. What? Yeah, I get it. Yes. Yeah. And I'm a horrible driver. <laughs> That's because you speed, woman, okay? Um, uh -huh. I don't have any defense for that. I know you don't have any defense for that. <laughs> um, where do you want to go? Um, pay I mean, any paywall, to be honest. I think, I, I assume the Portola 1 would be less, like, uh, would have less traffic. It's only two. Uh, yeah, the Portola 1 never has any traffic at all. Yeah. I feel like, at least. Stop and go. Yeah, I know, but I'm watching that other car because I'm scared that they'll start speeding across the road <laughs> while I'm driving there, which means I'll get crashed into, hunted into Future hell. Marshall. I'm gonna drive anyway. Um, both Sherry and Easy are trying to push me for the marshals. Oh, okay. Yep. And then I've been uh, I've been teasing with Duncan that I'm actually switching, so he's zooming. Are you switching? Mm, no. Unless that does they not sound very convincing. Okay, 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 okay. Unless they let me patrol. <laughs> I don't know. I want to patrol. Like I still want to get out there and do stuff and so on. Uh, I. Mm -hmm. It would be really cool if like they made like a marshals patrol section or something like that. I don't know, but. I mean, and then that would be kind of cool. I also talked to the chief today. She said she wanted to talk to me about us, chief. What? So now, yeah. So... I do I want this. I don't know. Because in my opinion, it should be Viv because of everything. Like, um... She was told she was getting chief, Nadia. Wait, she was actually, like, told? Yes. Please do not share this with anyone. Don't share this with Molokai or no, anything no, like that. Between the two of us, she was told she was getting chief. Like, the literally. Fuck? She was congratulated by the, the mayor's office and everything. Oh, She was told no. she was getting chief. Okay? So... But... Nino wanted a shift to as chief and it couldn't be Ruby. And Viv was very stern on like, Ruby is the best choice until I find someone else. And he didn't want it done. So weird. they decided to bring in someone completely new that has no idea how the LSP operates. Um, and it's like, it's I told they, uh, this is what I told the captain, right? I told him, uh, the, the chief. Um... I was completely surprised, and I understand that this is not on you or anything like that. Uh, but um, 
like uh, just people don't know who they are right and it's, it's true the reality of it so i don't know park away from majeros because they always have some fucking weird problem with the cars <laughs> tank on top yeah that's that's just fucked up yeah that it? was very fucked up not gonna lie yeah you're also gonna change aren't you You know me so well. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> I have some new stuff. Oh, I see how they've made the difference between both things. Okay. Ah, uh, there we go. This is so pretty, honey. Oh my god, no. What? What? Uh -uh. This, you know... You're not wearing that. <laughs> <laughs> Can I use this for work, honey? <laughs> what? Can I use this for work? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I feel like yeah. that would definitely fall in taste with your new boss, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah. If you guys, uh, stop changing, uh, do you still have your clothes, you know, the clothes you put on on? Because I, uh, I, well, you see. I can't make an outfit. Oh, I, I do. Uh, yeah. I, yeah, I still have mine. Yeah. Also, hi, Fiona. Hi. Uh. He's like, it's a you mm -hmm. issue. Yeah, I think Very it's a you issue. issue. God damn it. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, actually. Jane has very dark emo clothes and Anita has more colors nowadays. I try not to wear the same in these characters. I try to make them different. I low-key really like these pens. I actually really like them. They're really cool. I have an outfit with this pen. I'm making an outfit with these pens. I actually really like them. I mean, They have like a matching jacket and everything. But... Really? Yeah, they do. It's the, uh... It's the shirt. I'm not sure. Um, it's a jacket that's like... Oh, where is it? Uh, yeah, it's that one. Oh my god. It's only at the end. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea this <laughs> Oh it, my uh, god. It's Honey, I found my fit. Oh I god. found my fit. Hmm? Sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, you yeah, would love and support totally me like that, right? Um, right? Of course. Yeah, yeah, of course. I figured. Yeah, yeah. 
I'll just take one from your bunk and be like emo and start wearing these shirts, huh? I mean, if you want to steal my shirts, you're fine. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's actually adorable, too. Right? I need, like, more excuses to wear clothes like this. There hasn't been, like, anything, like, happening in the city in general to, like, no, to, like justify us, like, going out or doing something or whatever that isn't, like, you know, fishing or, you know, I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's not been anything. Uh, I know there's a place called The Furnace. That's like opening the fifteenth of August, I think. What is that? Uh, it's like a music place. Okay, that is cool. Unfortunately, that's the day I start hibernating for a week. It's <laughs> mm. fine. Hopefully, they'll do something once you're back. Yeah, they probably will. Okay, alright. Just basically want like another outfit for work to go to work. I don't feel like I can wear a turtleneck right now. Is that the dress? <laughs> Listen, it's great. Oh, also, I had like a workout, uh, a workout outfit wearing. I don't know what happened. It just fell out of my closet. No, out of my yeah, closet. It just fell out of your closet. Fell out of my closet. I lost it. Uh -huh. I lost it. That's not I lost good. It. No, it's not. I just lost it. I just love not having shoes for any outfits that I want to make. Right? Same. I and love not having good shoes. Aww. There we go, I fixed it. No shoes. No. No shoes. Uh-uh. Ah, what the heck? What about flip flops? You want to wear flips? <laughs> What's that? No, I don't. Please. I generally don't. Okay, good. That's... <sighs> Listen, if some people have that questionable taste, and I'm not going to judge, but I am probably going to judge. You're judging already? I am judging. I don't want heels because I'm gonna have to walk to Mission Row sometimes. I forgot about my car.
The horse boots? What the fuck are horse boots? Fuck. These ones aren't bad, but they don't match because of the shirt. Uh, yeah. The ones with the like you shaped fabric on it. Huh? This doesn't look good, I see. Oh my god, why? Oh, these ones. Okay, that's the same shirt. I'm changing shirt. What? No. I'm, I'm changing shirt what? colors. It's okay. I'm I was just looking through like oh. Okay, maybe I'm not because there's not <laughs> there's the choices no here are not that good. The, Fuck the man! Choice. God damn it! The good choice is green, alright. That is, yeah it is. Uh-huh. It is. No, no. I don't like this so much. Woman, how many outfits do you have? <clears throat> Not that many. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, where is it? What do you mean, yeah, sure? Nothing. I said nothing. I don't have that many. Uh huh. Uh -huh. I really want to. I really want to like do my hair differently. Oh, this. One. I legitimately don't know what to do with my hair. Well, how do you want your hair to look? I don't know. I I, I, don't, know. I don't know. Something you've done before, maybe? Or do you want something new? I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, don't know. know. I don't know. Here, this sunny. This. What do you think? So pretty. Doesn't look, it it doesn't look bad. What the? I... Oh really? Huh. You, I don't know who you remind me of. I, I, I look like Brookletti. Yeah, you. Oh God. I look like Brookletti. Uh, uh. Nope. What? Why? What the heck was wrong with Brooke? Or Brooke? Never seen her again. No, I'm just gonna cut my hair. If you gotta cut your hair, can you like not have a pixie cut? Or whatever the hell that's called. <laughs> what the heck? Curly nice hair. What about that one? 14. What? 14? What? <sighs> I'm just doomed. I'm never changing my hair, even though I hate every oh, hairstyle. Oh, wait, hold? I'm holding. One. If I do this, I have. To, I think I have to make it darker. Right. Yeah, you need to make it darker if you're gonna do that. This is the darkest I can go. Yeah, I don't know. Nah. Yeah. 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 It looks good, but I don't think it's gonna be any darker. Maybe that's it. Maybe I just need to change my hair color. What 
That's a very controversial thing to say, especially you. What? Because, I mean, I'm not going to uh -oh. say I'm against it, but like your hair color is uh -huh. kind of, it, it's like what everyone uh -huh. looks at and they're like, oh my god, that's Anita. Uh-huh. Okay. But, yeah, I think this is a great hit. <laughs> Maybe like this, honey. <laughs> so I'm not going through that much of a face, okay? Jesus. Okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where are they going? Let me fix my... Ah. Okay. I mean, you can, like, put your hair up or something. When? You can, like, put your hair up or something. But I already do that at work every yeah. day. Yeah. Yeah. It's true. I don't like this outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Why Daisy, do I come to kidding <laughs> when she said we were going to be trapped in here? <laughs> I'm just going to have a seat. I'm going to put a hat on this. No, I don't think a hat fixes it anymore. Listen, it's to make up all the other times that I don't come to a clothing store anymore. I mean, yeah, that's fair. Uh huh. Here, I'm just gonna have this this hair. Right. It just kind of looks like you're not showered. <laughs> This is complicated enough, okay? Yeah, I'm gonna I go know. back to my hair... braids. I'm just gonna go Listen, back to my braids. Hair I'm is super complicated. Back in my early 20s, and I just have braids. You had braids in your early 20s? Yes. I did. I used to uh -huh. use my hair ump. Um, and then... Uh, I joined a PD. I'll just have the Minerva hair because I miss her. Oh, I miss Minerva. I know. I miss Jess. <laughs> Where's our daughter? I know. My child is hot out about them the other day. What do you mean? What did she say? Like, I miss Minerva and Jess. <sighs> yep. I am. So. Yep. I know. They're better off. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. Um, yeah. So, uh, when I joined the PD a long time ago, uh, I had braids. Mostly used braids. Wow. I thought you saw. Um, hey, I, I thought you saw my little uh, going back, like when when we celebrate our like what two years or something done, a bunch of us. Like me, Pond, I think Daisy. I like Switch. I think I saw it. Not this. Like, oh, that's radar cute. Oh, this is the. This is the darkest that I can go. Oh, fuck. Oh, where is that? How bright is this? Okay. What do you think about this? I don't like the outfit by the way, I'm changing. Yeah, that's fair. 
Uh, hold on, let me turn around. Oh, that's cute. No, maybe I'll use a skirt. I literally had to look to the side to see if he had a skirt or not. No, wearing pants. <laughs> For once. For once? <laughs> yeah, have you seen like 90% of my outfits? Yeah, yeah. Skirts everywhere, yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's see if I don't wear the same as you though. Okay, let's change this. I, I think this could be a potential here, honey. I'm just saying. Listen, Why are my lot? legs so much more brighter than my arms right now? Are you just not... Are you just not sunbathing your legs? <sighs> I'm just... Uh... You know, if you check your legs, you could probably... Yeah, just, um... Um, the shock of um, Vin was a little bit um something. I I think this could be a potential, honey. Okay. Yeah, I think there could be potential it's here. The potential a lot of here. Potential. Yeah, of course. A lot. Okay, now you're just now now <laughs> you just sound like oh, okay. This is so cute, and I lost it for my workout outfit. I need to do it again. Yeah. Wait, what's the difference between this and the- oh. Okay. I really miss working on Wednesdays. Working on Wednesdays? Wait, what do you mean? Workout Wednesdays, like oh, in the past. yeah, ages ago. I'm gonna go back to black and red. Yeah, I miss workout Wednesdays too. I miss things. Yeah. Why is there like a gap between the shirt and my I my need another shirt? Yeah, I think I just need the other shirt. Yeah. I wonder if I just have the black call. Too black. See, I'm almost decided on one outfit. Let's see how long I'm gonna last with this one, though. Nice. I got this. I'm very responsible at all. You got this. Yeah, I was doing something I forgot what I was doing, though. Okay, I think I got my... Uh... Okay. I want... What do I The other ones. I'm making where it the <laughs> may as well. 
I don't know what you're insinuating. I don't know what you're insinuating. I'm not insinuating anything. Um, I'm just, you know, I'm here. So. Uh huh. That is true. You're here. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Let me see what I can. Bag or no bag? No one. Is there a red one? Nah. Alright, I'm okay with this outfit for now. Hmm? I'm okay with the outfit for now. You're for Important. Now. <laughs> Yeah, well, keywords were okay. Alright. I want to see. There's a sundress. I want to see if I can do anything with it. I want to see if it looks good on me. Is the blue one? Yeah. be very hit or miss so I want to see if it looks nice you got arms for this yeah oh my god these uh two colors What do you think about this dress? I really like how we're in very different spectrums of dresses. But yeah, it's the same it's... color. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? <my God. sighs> uh-huh. I don't know what to think about it's this dress. It's cute, but... I don't know. Hmm. Okay, so the colors that I like would be like... The yellow is nice. Yeah, the yellow is actually kind of nice. Mm. Got a white dress, honey. You are are you trying to tell me something? When we now we now our vows or something? <laughs> what? Yeah, the white no, dress for a second. Uh-huh. Listen, I was just looking at it. <laughs> I'd love to see how it looked, but it looked just bulky on me, so no. Okay, but look at the potential on this, honey. Oh, what? <laughs> look at the potential on the. Oh, trust me, I'm looking. <laughs> You're just saying that because <laughs> I have no pants on right now. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's it. Ah. <sighs> okay, uh huh. Listen, I don't. 
I don't know how I feel about that shirt, okay? This shirt? No, the, uh, the one before. This one that looks like I'm, I don't know, 70 years old? Yeah, it looks like you're 70 and you're trying to get dressed up. But it's just not working. I don't want an excuse just to wear this dress in black. <laughs> My ass looks great on it! Yeah, it does. What the heck? PD prom? <sighs> sure. PD <laughs> anything. Sure, it's totally happening. Oh. Oh, uh, yeah, totally. That's definitely gonna work, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Totally. Totally. What about perfect? This is perfect. I don't need to choose anything else. Oh, uh, yes, flip flops and a onesie. Yes, perfect. How's it going, y'all? How's it going, y'all? Hello. Um, it's Louise. Is that who I think it is? Yeah. Louise. Hello. How are you guys? Good. How are you doing? Hi, been chilling. How's life been? It's been good. How's PD life? That's okay. I haven't you achieved now. Oh. Yeah, um... Who's the new chief? You uh, you are from the Skeleton Crusade. You might know them. Uh, Daisy Moss? Daisy's back? Yes. She left, like, six days after. Like, what? Yeah, she's, uh, she's our new chief. I thought it would be more wow. publicly known. Uh. I haven't seen anything. Interesting. Okay. Well, you just found out the tea from me? Wow, congrats on your new chief that doesn't know anything really about the city. Wow. <laughs> okay, well, um, <laughs> you said it, not me. Is the, is Ruby still last chief? Uh, no. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, so, a lot of things Ugh. are changing, I guess. Like it is. Um, yeah, that's, um, that's, that happened. Nice. Is this, the, is this what you guys have got to expect now every time there's a new mayor, there's a new chief? Uh, probably. Ooh. I be. <laughs> that sounds rough as fuck. Yeah. Ah, uh, I mean, I don't, I'm, I'm living, doing my own thing, like, you know. Oh, the same yeah. Good to see you after for once. Yeah. I mean, I'm gonna be very honest with you, like uh Hello. even like when me and Nadia go off duty, like sometimes yeah. like we haven't done it a bit because I've been awful with uh it's literally like we, we go fishing or something like that. It's is Yeah. We also kinda lack things to do a little bit more than just, you know. But yeah. You know how life is. How you been? How's everything? Uh, I've been chilling. Just been vibing, really. Living life. Okay. It's nice being retired. And I'm very young for it still. <laughs> Fair.
I think the black belt is, is throwing me off. Funny, yay or nay? Uh, a bit too gray, isn't it? Yeah, I'm changing the hands. Like, there's three tones of these ones. Hmm. Why the blue doesn't... Actually, like the blue this? actually looks good. Yeah. Fucking... I'm just trying to get an outfit together right now, brother. Okay. I might keep this. I might. I lost the wall because I stopped paying for charity. Maybe. Have we checked like the other colors for the top? Yeah, there's a green that's nice and lazy. This one. So I was trying to kind of put it in. But like this, I'm. That looks the... really cute, though. Okay, but like the shoes and the top don't match. It kind of throws me off. Cause then there's green boots, but they don't match to. Where the black ones? Call well, it fuck it, and it matches the belt. You know what? I, I mean, yeah, yeah I'm like, it matches the belt. Like, the green ones were okay, a bit I'm doing too this. dark. I'm doing this before I change my mind. Yeah, do it. Alright, let me see if I... Okay. Alright. Take me out of this clothing store before I spend more time here. We're both wearing green. Right, let's go. <laughs> We're both wearing green. Just saying. Oh, is that a problem? No, it's fine. I was just saying. Hold on. I feel like no. my hair is Hold way too black, way too dark though. I can change the outfit. Oh my god! Of course you can. Of course you can. <laughs> Me. Here's to. True. Well, scarf. Fuck, scarfs have nails. What's up? Um, my hair is a little bit. Dark? I think. Oh, I'm putting a bracelet in. Bro. Did I not save this? Black top and jeans? That's little. I, I, I think I fucked them. Yeah, whatever. 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 Okay, whatever. 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 I'm gonna call Daisy and say, like, I wasn't in the clothing store for three hours. Oh, no. See if she even picks up. Good question. It might be a little bit too late for her. Yeah, I feel like it might be. Oh my kick your car! No, my car. I hear a dog. I want our dogs back. I want my cat back, but I also want our dogs. I want all the animals back. Yeah. Hey, honey, we could buy a house on Grove Street for a million. Hey, 
excuse me. I'm just, I was just checking what's available within our price range. Hey there. Or did you make grocery. five million during max XP? No, I didn't. I probably, no, I probably couldn't have. No, I don't think so. No. Even like the couldn't. people that were getting a bajilla probably got like a million or something. Yeah, something like that. And now we're getting no. like 800 bucks an hour, so. We're getting 800? I thought we were getting 1500. Finally changed two days ago, no one was informed. Uh, and cadets and PPLs are struggling to pay their cars, repairs, and food again. So, here we are. It's either great or it's either shit. Wow. We're... Instead of finding an in-between really where 1,500... Yeah, 1,500 was fine. It's not perfect, it's not bad. Yeah... <laughs> It wasn't perfect. Yeah, and then I'd buy a house. Horrible. I'd buy a house and then I'd be fucked. Supposed to get the like, money back. 800 an hour, that's not even enough to repair a car. I could go and do a group six shift and I would do more money in one shift than in a freaking week as, be as an officer. Yeah. Uh, that, that's how wild it is. Yeah. It's, and I'm um, getting fucking shot for the city. Yeah, I can go to Mosley's and earn like 1200 an hour. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Man, that fucking sucks. Even before we didn't get like 800, it was like 950 or something. But it was still bad. Yeah. Yep. I oh, know. I really want us to buy a house, but if these are what's available, kind of fuck. Yeah, I mean, just we'll just have to fucking wait until anything opens up. But I don't see it happening like yeah. too soon. Like I said, you got the mice part of the money at least for like a mil. Then if we need more, we'll figure it out. We'll see. Yeah. I mean, I doubt that, say, a beach house on a spooky is going to cause a mil. Yeah, but the... what if people buy it to flip it? You know? That happens. That does happen. Yeah. Uh, look at the house and grocery for yeah. a mill that is market price of 300. <laughs> like, nope. hello? <laughs> what? That is actually crazy, I know. It's wild and it's disgusting. But yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna buy up every single house when something opens on this bitch. If something opens up and I see it, I'll just... Listen, honey, just buy like, it from a tablet. I don't care. Just do it. I was gonna say, I'll just you fucking know, buy it. I don't care know, how it, it looks will... inside. I'm just buying it. It will... We'll just deal with whatever it is after. Yeah. Just make sure there's like one or two garage spawns at least. Wait, one or two what? Garage. Right, garage spot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like at least a two would be nice, but I guess we'll survive if there's one. We'll survive. We'll just have, I guess, your car parked there. It's whatever. Don't care. Fine. We'll see. We'll figure it out. Yeah. Taking you this time. Because they usually wake up 20 minutes past to restart, Eagle. And that's when the meeting starts, and Anita usually has to be the one, uh.
gonna guess he went to sleep. I forgot to ask, are you staying awake longer or are you going to bed? Yeah, I think so too, Jesser. Looks at wife is worried. What? Hi. Oh, what? I didn't hear your reply. What? I thought you were on the phone. I heard the phone ringing. I was like, well, no. she's on the phone. No, no, no. I'm no, sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. <laughs> oh no, I want to go to bed. No, I'm I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm going okay, to sleep. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay. I just want to double check. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I am. Um... I thought you were on the phone. No, I. Well, I was going to, but. He went to sleep, so I'll just check it myself. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I need to go to sleep. Uh, for legal reasons, I'm totally narrowly not falling asleep behind the wheel. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, I would never do that. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. That course. sounds irresponsible. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm, of course. Uh huh. I'm an adult. Smile. Yeah. I like to tell myself the same. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yep. Uh huh. Uh, what was I putting in here again? I uh, know. All oh, right. The worms. The oh my god! Oh, look here are the worms. Cat. What's wrong with the worm? I, it's just a few worms. There's, All right. There's just worms and not even like you just found them. Strange people threw those worms and you just got them. Well, um, it was just worms and I found it. Uh huh. And I put it in a jar with dirt. And now <sighs> they just kind of live there. Oh my. Hi. All right. I'm on the sixth floor. I am on. Mummify. I know, right, Tiff? Because that's what she the is. Floor. Nice. We're sitting at your place. Yeah, we are. Hi. I'm in a block. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I am. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Bro, I'm running out of air cells, man. For you know, I think the elevator. Take the elevator. Yeah, sure. Let's take the elevator. Yeah, yeah. What, what's yeah. the worst that could happen? You know what? I don't even think what. There it is. I, I don't even think the worst that could happen would even be bad. It's just... We could die. Well... I don't... I don't think we would die, right? I don't know. See, once I fine. fell, Once I fell out of the hole of the elevator and I got stuck under the elevator downstairs... And then, oh um... <laughs> he and Marissa had to... Take me out of there. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, that happened. That's not good. Yeah, no, not really. What? That's the apartment. Did you say anything? Saying that no, it was not good. Oh. Then Minerva heard about it and she's like, Why are you using the elevator? Oh no. <sighs> well, little does she know, I'm stubborn too. Feels laptop. Nice. What the? Heck? Wait, what are you playing though? I don't know. Oh, that's a wow. great question. 
You that know. is a great question. I'm yeah. just gonna use yeah. my phone then to play games. Yeah. 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 It's fine, I'll somehow get a really large game on my phone that totally works. Uh huh. Yeah, of course. Why wouldn't it? Yeah, exactly. I need to get some lights in here. Uh, that wouldn't be a bad idea. You have one it's light really and it's a lamp and it's kind of just in the corner. <laughs> yeah, it's um, it's my corner lamp oh. with my corner plant that's uh -huh. slightly like tilted. The lumber company um, has like a bajillion of things that they're selling. Just, yeah, I haven't had curiosity in buying anything until like you know. I, I kind of wanna. Of True. I actually kind of wanna like decorate my apartment a little bit more. I'm just saying, honey, you're really good at decorating. You should just make a like a business out of it. Hey. Business. Never know. Well, there, you know, I went to this raid. And the decoration was really good, and the girl twatted out, you know, uh, for PD. If you guys want, um, you know, some, some decorating services, call me on Yellow Pages. That's crazy. That was great advertising. That was great advertising. That, listen, that's actually really good advertising. I know, right? Get raided while decorating too. That would be a very interesting one. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna go to sleep, honey. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. Night, honey. Love you. Night. Love ya. Ah, <sighs> well, Melissa's doing it now. All right, all right. Still not a way to make it that Shane can hire. <sighs> nice. It's so smart. Okay, it's so nice. Shan, I'm gonna go to fog to sleep. What time is it? Midnight. Well, couple is like 8 a.m. So I do want to go to sleep and chill. Um. Okay, let me see. Oh my god, tap. Tap. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, guys. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you so much for being here. Um, I'll be back on Monday. Um, uh, probably start to stream with a need or something like that. And, um, yeah, I hope everybody has a great weekend. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow on Sunday and on server or anything like that. But, uh, you might see me on Jane. Thank you for everything, guys. Bye. Stay safe.